the audio check, quick audio check. We go ahead and do a sync check. We got one, two, one, two. And then one, two, one, two. Look, you're good.
There, I'm unmuted now. Hello. <laughs> I refreshed my tab because it was glitching out a little. Okay, there we go. We're back. We're back. We're good now. Okay. Hello. Good morning. Good afternoon. Hope everyone is doing well today. Um, doing Mario Kart. If you are new to stream, hello everyone. We are doing a Mario Kart tournament next Sunday at 11 a.m. I just put a command in chat to explain a little bit more about it. But that's what we're practicing for today. So if you're here for last month, tourney is going to be very similar to last month, except this time it's going to be no items. So it's fully dependent on your lines and your skips. So be here next Sunday, 11 a.m. PST, exclamation tourney in chat. So today we're practicing. Okay. Oh, I have a graphic that I was going to show you guys. <laughs> There it is. I made this. So this post is up on Twitter. I made this graphic. I think it's pretty fucking sick. Anyway, go follow my Twitter. Exclamation Twitter in chat. Okay, we can go ahead and get started. There's nothing that I really did over the weekend. Um, I know Hacker asked earlier if I caught up on SM 3D World Stars, which I didn't, Lamau. I, to I, to I totally forgot. <laughs> so I'm gonna play and catch up offline because I need to get it done by Thursday. Oh, wait. Oh, I have something else to show you guys. Okay. If you aren't already, go follow my Twitter, because you'll get, like, random posts throughout the week. Let's turn the music down. Change to something else. Okay, that's a bit softer. Okay. So, as you guys know, exclamation background or exclamation wallpaper in chat, I, I painted this. Isn't that cool? It's pretty pago. But, in the future, in the bottom left corner of your chat box, there's a channel for redemption called Change My Wallpaper. So over the weekend, I painted this new one. If you look closely, it's like this heart swirl tile. I think this one is pretty cool. Thank you for redeeming that, Issa. We're going to go ahead and change it right now. <laughs> so chatters, you can... We can change the wallpaper once a stream. That way we don't see the same wallpaper every day. So how it works is on the back, I have Velcro on each corner. So I I attach Velcro to my wall, rip the paint job, but you know, it's fine. It's our house, our rules. So let's go ahead and change that real quick. And this could be redeemed at any point during the stream, but it's only can be redeemed one time. Can you hear the, can you hear the Velcro? I don't know if you can. And I also decided that I'm gonna be painting them offline because like I found okay this cherry wallpaper took five no eight hours total because it was five hours on stream and then three hours offline but this heart wallpaper took me 13 hours total so no shot no way Jose am I doing it on stream ever again I thought you ripped it no it's the velcro honey dude I would I would Die in a video game if I ripped all of my wallpaper. I got pretty close though. You can't really tell. No, I don't think I tore this one. I didn't. I actually didn't tear this one. Okay, there we go. Look at that. Isn't that cute? So my goal is to try and get a new wallpaper painted every other week. That is my goal, because like I said... Okay, so this wallpaper, as you can see, it's not covering my whole wall. It's only covering what you can see in frame. Hi, D Hi Didi. Hi, Deacon. Welcome to stream. Hope you're doing well today. I got a new wallpaper. Uh, anyway. So... What was I saying? Oh, like I said, it takes freaking forever. Like I said, this one took 13 hours. The cherry took 8. So... I'm probably gonna try and do one every other week. That is my goal. There will be updates posted on Twitter. If I do, wait. Right there, you can see it's out of frame. I did this one too small. Do you guys see that? You can see how it lines up right here? I did it out of frame. Fuck, my chair blocks it anyway. It's fine. <laughs> but yeah, so exclamation wallpaper in chat. Like I said earlier, chat can change my wallpaper once the stream. It's a redeemed earlier, so we can change the wallpaper again tomorrow. Looks like a couple of fables. Oh, without your glasses on. I was like, what are you talking about, Didi? I was like, how the fuck? I think it looks cute. I thought it looked like little peppermint swirls. Like, you know, the little, like, candies you get for Christmas? 
Anyway, so that that's that's literally all I did this weekend. I think because I was working on like a commission. I got commissioned to make some graphics, guys. I'm gonna be a fucking artist. Uh, let's get started. <laughs> Enough stalling, am I right? Okay. So today we are practicing for the no item tournament. So I'm probably gonna make like a custom, I guess, computer match with no items. And then we could do no items online. As you can see, similar to last week, we do have donation stakes enabled. So, every $5 donation or gifted sub, I will wait at the finish line for 5 seconds. So if you want to troll, do that. Or, every 100 bit cheer, I will intentionally fall, uh, fall off or spin out. That similar last week, it's just like an extra thing for anybody who does choose to donate today. We're not going to do it every week, but since today we're practicing... Why not mess with me a little bit, you know? Okay. Let's go ahead and get started. Yeah, peppermints are icky. No, wrong one! <laughs> um, let's do versus, no items. Also, we do have a channel point redemption to change my character, guys. Um, I know for the tournament we're gonna do 150, but honestly, I love 200. We're gonna do 200 first. Items, no items. Uh, no teams. Let's do hard comms for funsies. Um. <laughs> Let's do 48. <laughs> We're not gonna do all 48, mind you. This is just so we don't get, like, repeat maps. Wait, uh, I, I, I meant to do random. <laughs> okay, let's get started. Oh, I gotta get our prediction up. Okay. Blue shy guy? Oh, cool. Thank you for redeeming that now. Let's change that real quick, actually. Wait, I just realized for custom matches, I can't change my character every match. Sag. Okay, we're gonna keep playing with shy guy, then we're gonna stay with shy guy for now. Or, uh, what should we do? What should we do? Okay, let's just do four races, and then we can choose... Freeze. I think that'll be better. Let's do that. That way chatters can still redeem. Okay, getting my prediction up now. Mod check. <laughs> First. Yeah, she the best. No shot. I'm <laughs> you fine. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. Sorry, I'm, I'm making the prediction. My options are first, question mark, yes, blue, believe, yeah, she the best, or doubt, no, I'm a hate watcher. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, go place your bets. Prediction is up. Go place your bets. Oh my god. Wait, I did the wrong thing. <laughs> uh, any doubters? Any secret hate watchers want to doubt? Okay, let's get started. <laughs> If you're new to stream and, and don't know how channel point works, I'm gonna go ahead and link the Twitch help article explaining how to earn them and how to use them. Oh, you said black? Oh, I can't read. Fuck. <laughs> oh, we got a thousand and believe, let's fucking go. Yeah, guys, this is no items with party comms, 200 CZ. I can totally clutch and get a first here. Unless we have any doubters. Doubters mod check? <laughs> Oh, I also have a drink today. This is, um, there we go. This is one part orange juice, two parts apple juice, one part strawberry puree, and then a splash of water. <laughs> it's gonna be so weird playing without items. Like, I'm not used to this at all. Because all the other no items run. I've done is where, um, like, I'm the only one who can't use items, but everyone else can. Yeah, I agree. I love the shade of blue. It's like this nice cerulean medium shade. It's lovely. Oh, does anybody have any- <laughs> Fuck. Anybody have any plans for Memorial Day? I know I don't, Lamau. I didn't even realize it was a holiday till like, two days ago, because my parents were like, oh, we're going on a trip, and I was like, really? They're like, yeah. I was like, fuck, I'm not invited? Okay, I didn't want to go anyway, because, okay. 
anybody who else who went on like car road trips when you were younger, weren't they like never fun? I mean, just being in the car with your family, like, like cramped in a little car with like all the fucking kids, it's unpleasant to say the least. So I didn't want to go anyway. <laughs> I don't know why my shoulders are so, so tense. Yeah, Memorial Day. Yeah, exactly. Fuck, I missed it. I think it's... Because my mom works for the school, so she has, like, the Monday off, I believe. And then they have, like, a snow day, so she gets a four-day weekend. But, you know, I don't have a job, so... It's, it's all the same for me. Like, everything just blends together, am I right? Oh, your mom's 60? Dude, that's crazy. First, easy clap. I mean, my mom had me when she was, like, kind of older, too, but she was, like, 35-ish. But... Oh, so they would have been 44. That's still really old. I mean, nothing wrong with it, as long as, like, the, the baby's happy and healthy. Like, people can have babies whenever they want. But it's still, like, very uncommon. On to the next baby! <clears throat> Because I think my parents were married for about six years before they had me. Okay, on to the next. I'm very happy and very healthy. I'm glad to hear that, man. Very ha happy to hear that, Didi. Okay, new prediction is up. Go place your bets, Jet. Yeah, Memorial Day was like always a holiday that I I never like was into. Cause like I said, we didn't like on vacations much when I was little because you know we were poor so <laughs> and like we don't have any family nearby so it's not like we could like go out and see them you know what I wish with like the online ranked lobbies for Mario Kart it'd be cool if you could like similar to how you can set up tournaments where you can like set up like different or specific parameters like, have an open lobby that people can join that are not just your friends. Is that a thing? Because I think it would be cool, because, like, we could do, like, the no items today run with online lobbies, but then it feels weird if I'm the only one not using items, right? Oh! Sorry, the ramps started lifting! <laughs> okay, that was a horrible line. Actually, horrendous. You actually want to go to school? I think something is wrong with you, Issa. Slash J slash, um, SRS. <laughs> Honestly, I was one of those kids, too. Because, like, I very much like going to school, like, being able to see my friends. And, like, it gave you, like, a sense of structure. And, like, I didn't, like, go out much when I was, like, on the weekends. So I, I didn't get to see my friends. I didn't get to hang out. <laughs> Dude, easy clap. I almost chose the doubt outcome. Give me one sec. Okay, sorry. For my end, for some reason, the game capture like looks laggy, but it looks fine on the stream. I think it's just my preview monitor that's fucking up. But you know, I haven't streamed in a few days. It's tight, it's fine. <laughs> Okay, new prediction is up for this track. Go place your bets. Okay, also, you've noticed here. Oh, yeah, here. I removed my donut goal. And now we have, like, the sub leaderboard. Because I think that looks cooler. But as you can see, because I'm capturing the window right now with my chat box. And it's capturing the stupid predictions, and it's annoying. But it's fine, it's fine. It's okay. 1.5k, I believe! Oh my god, any doubters? Okay, what if I intentionally throw a race? Or what if somebody gives a sub and then I throw a race? And then doubters just win? Th that's a strat for you guys. Anybody who wants to rank up some points? Uh, all you <laughs> Okay, all you have to do is donate to make me lose. That's literally all you have to do. <laughs> 
I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Don't feel inclined to donate. Don't do it unless you want to, okay? Okay. I am also broke and poor, so I get it. <laughs> My god, how'd they pass me? Sorry, I do not know why I'm yelling right now. I do not need to be talking this loud. <laughs> hi, Mac. Welcome to stream. Oh, you can't stay today? No problem, man. We'll see you next time. But I appreciate you coming in and saying hi. The pleasure is always, Mac. Just make sure you're here next Sunday. We're doing a tournament. You have to be here for that. <laughs> Dude, I am so far ahead. I'm absolutely crushing everyone right now. Okay, I keep on getting comments on my TikToks about like, oh, you should use this bike build, and like, that's fine. But also, keep in mind, Chatters, all of the clips that are on my TikTok right now are from literally months ago. Like, the ones that I've queued up are from, I think, March, and right now it is May. So by the time TikTokers see this clip, it'll probably be like, what, July? By the time I get to editing down this VOD? <laughs> so like, hopefully by then, I'm like, I'll have my bike build changed. Cause like, I keep, I keep on getting people saying like, oh, you should try inside drift? Cause like, or no, outside drift, cause this is an inside drift bike. But I don't know, kinda cringe. Currently using data? Oh, frick, that sucks. Twitch literally eats up all of your data. And it's disgusting how much it eats. Thankfully, I have like a limit, um, a limitless? Uh, no, unlimited, that's like limit, this means the same thing, doesn't it? I have an unlimited data plan. So if I wanted to like watch Twitch on my bike rides, I could totally do it. Okay, new prediction is up. Go place your bets, guys. Keep in mind, Pokemon Mall is kind of a different, difficult track. I think last week, this is the one that I did not get first in. So, I don't know. This one could trip me up. We got 1k, I believe. Let's fucking go. Any doubters? Come on, can somebody please put like 10 points in doubt? Just put 10, and then I, okay, I won't throw on purpose, but it would be kind of funny. If someone put 10, like, just 10 points in doubt- Let's fucking go! We got a doubter! Finally, someone did it! We got 20 in doubt! <laughs> okay, let's go, let's go. Finally, there's some stakes to our predictions now. Regulars, no. Predictions are only fun if there's, like, people gambling on both sides. I mean, not gambling, voting. Predicting. Because how predictions work is the winning decision gets to steal all of the opposing side points. <laughs> Team down. <laughs> oh fuck! Okay, that, that was actually horrible. That was horrible. I could have like thrown the race right there. Wait, do the cars move? Sorry, I heard their engines revving and I got excited. Yeah, my dad, when he was younger, like, I, in his 20s, he used to drive a motorcycle. But then he almost got in an accident. So then he stopped. <laughs> and, like, I brought up the idea of, like, getting a moped or a motorcycle to him, and he's like, no. Do not do that. I'm like, okay. Bet. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna do it. Like, because, like, if you're in a car and you get hit, like, you, you're you protected by the car. And you also have, like, an airbag. You're, you're, it's a lot harder to, like, get absolutely fucked up if you get hit. But if you're on a bike, you just have a helmet. And, like, maybe a sick, cool-ass leather jacket to protect you. Which is not enough. Not nearly enough. <laughs> so, guys... And also, I think you have to have, like, a separate license to drive a motorcycle. So you have to take a whole other class entirely. So, poor investment, unsafe, 0 out of 10, not worth it. But you do look cool. You do look cool. <laughs> Doubt for the win, no shot. Oh wow, we went up to 80 points in doubt? Dude, that's fucking crazy. Dude, I like playing with no items. It's so nice. So nice. <laughs> Sorry, it's it's just so funny. Seeing the banner where it's saying, yeah, she the best. <laughs> You're getting so much back, let's go. <laughs> it stonks, exactly. <laughs> 
Invest big, win big, guys. <clears throat> I don't see videos of people on, like, mopeds. But I see a lot of videos... Well, I can change my character. Anybody want to change my character? <clears throat> um... I've seen videos with, like, the... what you call it, what you call it. No, what are they called? It's not, like, the hoverboards, but, like, the electric scooters. I always see them around town in, like, Seattle. And I'm like, should I try it? But then I'm like, I don't have a helmet, I'm gonna fucking die. Your new prediction is up. Go place your bets, chatters. <clears throat> it's out of stock still, really? Oh, Sag. Next time. <laughs> it seems embarrassing. Like... <clears throat> Let me think. Oh, I did it too late! Fuck! Okay. <laughs> I feel like the electric scooters are fine. I think it would be cool if you could, like, rent a helmet as well. But then also you have to think about, like, how many people have worn that helmet before it's gotten clean. Because, like, my main concern, like, I try and be as safe as I can whenever I'm out riding my bike. Because as you guys know, I started riding my bike again. Let's fucking go. And, like, the other day... I went out riding without my helmet on, and I got so scared because I didn't realize till I was halfway through my ride. And I usually go for like three miles because like I was heading home, and I was like, "Why? Do, why is my head so cold right now? Like I can feel the wind on my ears and my forehead." And then I was like, I touched my head. I was like, "Fuck! I don't have my helmet." And <laughs> I have this huge anxiety of like, okay, because like the cops can take you if you if you aren't wearing a helmet. They could totally do that. They have the right to do that. So, like, I have this insane anxiety of any time, like, even if I just go down, like, my street without a helmet on, like, a cop is gonna come up to me and, like, beat the shit out of me or something. <laughs> and he'll be like, I'm gonna beat the shit out of you, and look, you're gonna get a black eye because you're not wearing a helmet. Lamau. <laughs> uh. So, like, I, I biked him extra fast that day. Big Bam Bowser. Okay, we'll do Bowser next pre. Next pre. Or next next round. <clears throat> Easy clap first. I need more of a challenge, guys. They should have, like, super difficult computers. <clears throat> Hospital and prison stream. <laughs> Yeah, let's fucking go, dude. That'd go hard. But imagine, imagine how many. Okay, what the title would be insane. And I'll wait. Sorry, I'm thinking. I'm thinking. Hi, Scooters. Thank you for the free subscription. I appreciate it. Enjoy your ad viewing and cool sub only emotes. Big fan of Meg Esports. So yeah, let's fucking go. Next term is gonna be on Sunday. Exclamation turning in chat for more info. But hi, welcome to stream. Hope you're doing well today, man. Any doubters in the chat? We need some doubters, guys. Okay, actually, I'm I'm dog shit at this track. Ah, oh, Peach got collapsed. Okay, I, I that line I think is the most difficult in the entire fucking game. Even more difficult than Neo Bowser City. <laughs> Arrested for playing Mario Kart gone wrong. Okay, that that's a good contender. Um, okay, you know how like. Okay, this is actually really bad. If anybody's a fan of, like, Markiplier, I feel like any video of him talking about, like, He pushed me into the car. Any video of him talking about, like, going to the hospital gets, like, an insane amount of views, right? Because the thumbnail is just him sitting in the hospital bed. Not saying that we should do that. <laughs> okay, but what if... Because the way that Twitch thumbnails work is that it shows a preview of the stream from, like, two minutes ago, I think. And then it refreshes every two minutes. So you can't, like, customize your thumbnail. What if... For that stream. It was just a picture of me like edited to sit in a hospital bed. Okay, I'm actually throwing. I'm literally throwing this race. We had 33% of doubt. Good choice. Get honestly, that was the best choice you guys have ever made. <clears throat> K 
Okay, back to first BB! Oh, I thought that was the last lap. Fuck me, dude. Policeman through the game. <laughs> okay, see, like, we could go down that route, but then also, I feel like some people will be like, you fucking live. <laughs> oh. Because, like, I'm all for, like, police reform, all that shit, but, like, I'm scared of, like, the audience who's, like, gonna be like, you fucking hate cops. Oh my god, the. Wait, wait! I forgot. For every subscription, I'm supposed to pause, right? Whoopsie. <laughs> I forgot. I forgot. I forgot. I totally blank. Okay, next race, since um, Scootish resubscribed, we're gonna stop at the finish line for five seconds. I totally blanked. Oh, you wanted me to win? Oh, you're so cute. But I actually won. That's crazy. I, I never went at this track. What do we have? We had 40 points to believe, 30 points- or 20 points to doubt. No, don't do that win. True. I'm gonna throw the next race. I'm gonna throw the next race, because you did subscribe. I have to follow my dono stakes. <laughs> um... On to the next. <clears throat> don't hate me, he was extremely nice! <laughs> See, I did cheat. I- I did cheat. Wait, I think we- I think I have an emote for scam. A 7TV one. Yeah, I do, I do. It, it's <laughs> scammed in all caps. <laughs> thank you, Arzine, for the follow. I appreciate it. Feel free to chat, like, whatever makes you happy, man. But thank you for the follow. New prediction is up, guys. Go place your bets. <clears throat> it's scammed. Dude, I am such a chatter. Like, I still have to chat- like, type emotes in my own fucking chat room. Like, I do it all the time, whenever we do a Yulapi lose. Like, I be typing Kek W in my own chat room. <laughs> I was thinking about it the other day. And I think my favorite chat rooms have got to be, like, Prezzo's and Connery's Pants. Because their chat room, like, for every 20 messages, it's, like, 18 emotes. Like, is everyone just, like, spamming Jake S or capital D colon? And then, like, a chatter saying a funny joke. And, dude... That is, I think, my dream chat room. Because I saw this one TikTok, and this person was, was explaining that the reason why they, like, encourage emote spam in chat is so, like, if there's, like, a weird message or something that makes you uncomfy, you can just ignore it and say, like, oh, my chat room is moving way too fast, Laval. And I was like, that is actually so valid and actually so true. Okay, remember, I have to throw this race. I have to stop and wait for five seconds. Okay, that was bad. That was a horrible line. Oh, wait. Wait, oh, yeah. I'm gonna do it now. It's five seconds. Because there's the parachute at the end, so I can't necessarily stop at the end. Oh, come on. We can still, we can still beat him. Wait. Th Third. Fuck. Sag. The Hate Watchers won this round. <laughs> we had no believers? Come on. Come on, that's kind of rude. I know I said I wanted more doubters, but no believers? Kind of cringe, chat. Kind of cringe. Okay, on to the next one. <laughs> okay, new prediction is up. Go place your bets, chat. This is gonna be a normal race. We got no donations, so no stakes. Okay, I'm absolute dog shit at this map. I... Why could- The only map I wanted from the DLC was Coconut Mall, and we got it. So I'm like, I'm just happy for anything else we get. But also, I don't like this one. It's too confusing, way too many routes. It is difficile. We got 10 doubters? Okay. I'm surprised that the prediction let me put Hate Watcher. Because usually, like, Twitch makes you censor, like, bad words. Dude, there's a skip at the start where you can, like, trick off the little koi pond. It's insane. Like, it doesn't save much time, but also, the line is way too tight. I can try it on the next lap, just to show you guys. 
Yeah, exactly. Exactly. When your Wi-Fi crashes, go touch grass shatters. That's what you have to do. It's a sign. Okay, let's go ahead and try that Koi skip. One more time. I think the first time I saw the skip was when I- Cause like, I watched Connery's fans play it right here, right here. So like, you trick off of here- OH MY GOD! Dude, I almost had it! I literally almost had it! You guys see that? Okay, we're gonna totally try to get next lap. Hi, Fitness Gamer. Welcome to stream. Hope you're doing well today. Okay, back in first. Easy. What was I talking about? I forgot what I was talking about. I was, like, way too high that I actually kind of almost got the skip. No! Okay, that was horrible. Oh, um, Fitness Gamer, if you have any preferred nicknames or pronouns, make sure to tell me. Otherwise, feel free to chat, lurk, whatever makes you happy. Okay, I forgot that I was gonna go for the skip that time. I totally blanked. I am sorry. <laughs> My reputation as a <laughs> No, not a tutorial. But, like, I think it's so funny because I was talking to Rainy about it, and she was like, Your TikTok is like just giving people tips and tricks on how to play Mario. And I was like, Kind of, but like, not really. Oh, I was gonna say, this is not an educational stream. That was gonna be the joke. Comedy. <laughs> okay, you know when you have a joke in your mind, but you don't, like, you have the premise, you have the shtick, but you don't know how to execute it? That is me, like, all the time. Because, like, I feel like I got lots of, like, good ones up here. I just slapped my leg. But I just, I just can't commit to that. Oh, you love Rady? Dude, I fucking love Rady games. Wait. Oh yeah, I got third last race, didn't I? I was like, how am I at 55 points? <laughs> Megan 4K, are you gonna catch me in 4K, DD? <laughs> okay, let's go on to the next race. <clears throat> okay, let's do a few more. Rounds with computers, and then we'll go to online. Oh yeah, so it's the redeemed Bowser last one. <laughs> okay, let's see. Okay, now let's actually do tracks that I need to practice. Okay, I say that, but I really want to play DK Jungle. <laughs> hey, new prediction is that go place your bets, chat. You guys can clip the stream. If you think if you see something funny, clip the stream. It's easy. It's fun. And also, do you like reading? Little random, but not. Okay. Oh, uh, let me pause for 10 seconds to think about what I'm gonna say. Wait, sorry. I have my, my my cherry wallpaper right here. I just realized I didn't paint one of the leaves. There's a cherry with only one leaf on it. Sorry, I'm not in a good mood now. <laughs> on, on that topic, you, you know when you, like, draw something and you think it's, like, decent? And then, like, right after you post your drawing, it's missing something? Like, you forgot to erase a line, or, like, there's a smudge on it, and you're like, fuck, I already posted it. I missed the skip. Anyway, it's fine. I'm- I'm fine. I'm- I'm doing great. I'm doing great. And, like, people, like, looking at your art, or, like, are just, like, scrolling past, right? They aren't, like, I guess, analyzing it. So they're not gonna see, like, every single thing you miss, right? But you, as, like, the person who made it, you're gonna, like, see every single flaw and mistake that you made. That's also a big reason why I don't post- a lot of the art stuff I make anymore. Like, all the stuff I do, I, I keep it to myself now. Mainly because I feel like there's like a standard. There's like a level of like, craftsmanship that I want to reach. And like, I feel like I'm not at that point. That's why like my Instagram, exclamation Instagram and chat if you want to like go follow. But, well, I'm out. <laughs> but I haven't like, I legit haven't drawn in like a year. Like seriously, like I'll just do my like, assignments for school because I'm in graphic design school guys so I do like illustrations for like homework 
But like, I don't post them. Because one, we're not allowed to post our homework. Because that's like, technically like sharing curriculum, which is illegal. And I could get expelled. So I can't do that shit. But also... What are we doing? <laughs> so like, that's why like, I feel like my artwork is getting there. Like I'm working on like rendering and like style. Because a lot of the work I used to do was just like looking at a photo reference and then drawing. So I don't have like a distinguished style yet. So hopefully I can start working on it. Hi Chaotic, I hope you have a good day. Thank you for coming and chilling with us today. Megan, are we okay? Yes, I'm okay. I'm fine. I am a-okay. I'm doing great. I'm doing lovely. I'm having a good day. Guys, I didn't even get top three. I did not even get fucking top three. And we had no doubters. We had no doubters. I think I was too distracted. So that is why I lost. The hate watchers win this race. <laughs> Can I just say it's so fucking funny? That it, thank you for clipping the stream. I appreciate it. It's, uh, oh, what were we talking about before? We were, we were like talking about reading, right? How do we get to drawing from reading? I think it's because I... Oh yeah, I got distract distracted by my wallpaper. Okay. Let's choose a difficult one. I hate all of these. Let's do Bowser's Castle, because we're playing as Bowser, aren't we? Hey, new prediction is up. Go face your bets, guys. <clears throat> yeah, I agree. I get genuinely so... But the Pikachu fell? No, it didn't. It's right here. Stop trolling. Um, I get so, like, discouraged, like, looking at my, um... Random stages. No, I need to practice the stages I'm bad at, Issa. You know that, honey. <laughs> um, I get so discouraged looking at my sketches because like when you look at like artwork right you always see like the final product you don't necessarily see like the work in progress so if I'm looking at like a sketch or a drawing that's not fully rendered I'm like this looks like dog shit I'm like how because like I don't know it's just like very mentally discouraging <laughs> because like I understand that the more like time you put into it, the more skill you have, like, your renders will look good when they're final. But if I'm looking at, like, a pencil sketch for two hours, as I'm, like, getting my shapes and my forms and my, like, the tones and shades right, I'm like, I can't do this. Well, okay, how to- how to- That was rude, that was rude. I got stuck by the rock. Okay, talking about reading, do I like reading? As Hacker asked five minutes ago at this point. When I was little, I used to be like so into reading. Because I don't know about you guys, but we had this program called AR Testing. So it was essentially you read a book and then you log into this program and then you it would it would ask you questions about the book that you read. And each type of book would have like a different point scale. So like a little picture book with 10 pages would be five points. And then like a chapter book would be like 20 points. So we had that system when I was little. And because of that, like, I wanted to try and get, like, the most AR points for the year, right? So I would read so many books when I was little. But then after, like, junior high and the, like, entry of, like, high school, I stopped reading. Because at that point, like, books aren't fun. Because that's when you start, like, getting required reading for summer vacation. You're like, this is not cool. This is not Pago. No, this is not Poggers. <laughs> I, okay, for the longest time, I confused Pago for, like, Poggers. So, but Pago is kind of, like, weird champ. Because, like, you, you put Pago if it's, like, oh, that's weird. That's cringe, right? I threw, I threw. I'm gonna get crushed! I'm a Wattpad reader and I'm not ashamed. Okay, you guys know I had a Tumblr era. Wattpad was also part of that Tumblr era, Megan. Because, like, Wattpad is fine. I think it's good for, like, little kids to have an outlet to write and read. But also, it's just fucking cringe. Like, the writing is so bad. So, I look back on my Wattpad era. Okay, I didn't write anything. So don't be looking for shit. I did not write anything. 
I just appreciated other people's work, is what I will say. <laughs> Look, I almost dropped my controller. Okay. I don't know why I'm so, like, hyper today. Okay, you know why? It's because I have sugar. This is straight fucking pure sugar. Sam, I love queer media. We need more of it in, in mainstream. Am I right, guys? A new prediction is up. Go place your beds, chat. Yeah, I think I'm about halfway through Heartstopper. Well, well, um, I need to practice... Okay, I know I need to practice the skip in Mute City. Uh, I don't think we should do that because since the pre- or no, the tournament's gonna be 150, I won't be able to do the, the skip. So... I definitely need to practice Big Blue. Because, like, the first half of the track ain't that bad. But the final section is difficile. My sugar rush era, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. Silly Goofy Megan is, like, Megan after, like, 9 p.m. Because, okay, that's when I start taking my gummies. Because as the doctor said, I should start taking melatonin. Which, it's been about two weeks, right? Okay, I don't know if this is normal, but I take about 10 milligrams a night, which is the recommended amount for the ones I got. But also, I've, I've never been able to get like REM sleep before, because I always have like interruptions in the night. I don't have sleep apnea, I just don't sleep well. But like ever since I started taking gummies, I've had like weird and like borderline nightmares every single night. Like, I think the first night I took melatonin, I had, like, a dream that uh, an axe murderer, like, came and killed my whole family except for my sister. And then it led into, like, this whole long-ass dream where we were, like, put into the foster care system. Because it happened when I was, like, 16 and my sister was, like, 14. And, like, we essentially, the dream was, like, um, a CBS primetime drama <laughs> about me living my life as a foster child going from home to home. And I was like, that was weird. That's a bit much. And then I think the next nightmare I had, I was at an amusement park, and then the amusement park was like taken over by these cult leaders, so they were like taking people captive and stuff. And and then the rest of my nightmares are just like cringe high school dreams, which I feel like everybody has, but it's just cringe thinking of people you haven't thought about in years, right? But, oh my god, I think about it, and I graduated high school five years ago, and I want to like video game myself. But like I said, in a video game. Because it's like, not that I haven't accomplished much, but I'm still finalizing my degree, so hopefully Megan will get a real job in a year. But... I don't know. Wait, I got first! Holy shit, I wasn't even paying attention. I was like... I was focusing, and then also... Like, just reliving those nightmares I had. <laughs> okay. Wait, what I get? I got first. Okay. Yeah, I don't know if that's normal. Because, like, you know when you look up, like, medical side effects on, like, WebMD, and then they just give you, like, the craziest shit? You'd be a great life has changed character? Uh, maybe. Okay, I need to practice Rainbow Road. I am a pro with computers, but online, dog shit. Absolutely horrible. You'll be back later. We'll see you later, Hacker. I appreciate you hanging out with and chilling with, uh, with us today. We'll see you later, hun. <laughs> new, new prediction is up. Go place your bets, chat. <laughs> it's a- wait, it's a- sorry, I'm looking back at chat. You're like, my dream was me taking an art class with my crush. Anyway. <laughs> you know, okay. Um, uh, I know I don't necessarily read every single chat message. Main reason why I don't do that. I, okay, I know my chat room is very small, so I should be reading everything. Bye, Didi. We'll see you next time, hon. Hope you have a good day. Um, the reason why is I try and read messages that I can, like, play off of and, like, give my input on. Because, like, I think it's cringe when people, like, just read a chat message but then don't add anything to it. So you're literally just reading chat. You're not, like, having an active conversation. Or, like, your chat room is not, like, additive to the commentary. So that is a big reason why I don't read every single message. So don't be mad if I'm quote-unquote ignoring you. I'm not. It's just, it's hard for me to, like... Because, like, 
for example, like, if I gave everyone attention, let's say we had, if we ever get to this point, 30 people chatting, and I read every single message, the stream would be boring, right? Because then I'm just reading chat. Like, instead of playing in the game, I'm just reading chat. Like, that's fine. But that's not the vibe I want to go for. Because to me as a chatter, my goal is to gain my streamer's attention. Right? So, I'm not going to say wild shit, mind you. I'm just going to say, like, a funny joke. And if I can't think of anything funny, I'll put, like, heck W. <laughs> but, it's like, while we're still small, I want to mold you guys into, like, my, my dream chatters, okay? Because, like, as we all know, it's very easy to, like... Because, essentially, as a creator, like, as a streamer, your chat room is, like... Your chat room has a lot of control over, like, your stream in terms of, like, your commentary and what you say. So, for example, if you guys talk about dogs, it's gonna steer that direction towards dogs, right? So that's why, um... I have to be very careful to not allow, like, weird or, like, weird champ shit, right? Um... Because, like, I don't want to be itemized, I don't want to be idolized or, like, sexualized. Like, I have to, like, nip stuff in the bud. I know I keep saying this, but, like, I let stuff slide. By that, I meant one chat message a while ago. And it's like, I'm not gonna do that shit no more. I only want wholesome chatters. We don't want simps. Wait, wait, talking about simps, talking about simps. <laughs> You deserve the world. Oh, thank you. You're so cute, Didi. Oh, you're still here? Oh, you're just- you're- you're fucking lurking? Okay. You're trolling. <laughs> um, I made a new command. I think it's funny. So, if we have any fucking simps... <laughs> that's just, like, a quiet way to be like, lay off. I have a command for it, so... No simps in chat. Wholesome chatters only. Because, <laughs> like... It's very hard. To like, how would you say it? Because there's certain people, okay, you don't know if they're crazy or not, right? You have to be careful because you don't want to, you want to like, let them down lightly, but also not too lightly. Because you want to like, stop the behaviors, right? Um, I think the big thing is, okay, let's do one more, let's do one more. And then we'll do online. Let's see. What was they saying? New Bowser City, obvi, because they're playing Bowser. Can you do a prediction? <laughs> what is it saying? Oh, because you don't know if there's gonna be any crazy people, right? So you have to like be firm, but also not too light. Oh no. Can you do predictions up go gamba chat, go place your bets. But you have to be careful when you're small and still growing, because you don't want to, like, fester a toxic community, essentially. Anyway, talking about something lighter. <laughs> Today on my bike ride, I saw a frog. Because, like, the, the trail that I bike on, on, it's, like, it's kind of, like, a marshy area, so there's lots of frogs, lots of birds. And, like, the birds, they always fight super, way, like, literally way too close to me. <laughs> and, like, as I was biking, okay, when you're biking, or like when you're walking, like anywhere, you have to like watch where you're like stepping because there's dog shit everywhere, unfortunately. And like as I was looking at the trail, there was like a little frog. I took a picture of it, I'll show you guys in a second. And like I, I got off my bike and then like I, I walked up to it because like it was on the pavement trail, which they usually don't do. And it was just sitting there. I was like, this is cool. And like my Samsung camera. I wish it had, like, a better zoom. I can probably get an attachment, because, like, no shot I'm gonna bring in my DSLR camera on a bike ride. Because, like, imagine I crash and then I fuck up my camera. Feels bad, man. So, like, I walk up to it, and I'm, like, three feet away. I zoom in. Not a good picture. I take a few steps two feet away. And I start crouching down to, like, take a picture. Frick. Um. And I get, like, no joke, like, six inches away from the frog. And it's, like, not moving. Its eyes are open. I take a picture. It's a sick-ass picture. It's on my Twitter. I'll show it to you guys after this race. Um. And as I'm, like, taking the picture, I think to myself, is it sleeping or is it dead? Because there's, like, there's dirt on its legs and, like, also, like, the little cottonwood, like, fluffs on it. Like, stuck to it. And I was like, is it dead? And then I was thinking, and then I rode away. Because it still wasn't moving, like, I got super close to it. I was like, should I touch it? I was like, no. That's how, like, disease spreads, so we're not gonna touch the frog. 
and like I start riding away and I think to myself, is it psychopath behavior if I take a picture of a dead animal? Granted, it's not like it's roadkill, it's just like sitting there still, but... And I was concerned. I was like, was it dead? So then I, I loop around and thank god the frog was gone. So it was not dead. Megan is not a psychopath. It was just sleeping with his eyes open. <laughs> okay, let's actually show the frog. <laughs> It's, it's actually a super cool picture. Yeah, don't pull a Katie Lamau. Okay. Let's see. Oh, here it is, here it is. If you aren't already, go follow my Twitter. I post random shit. Also, funny jokes sometimes. Okay, it's right here. Isn't it cute? And, like, it's a pretty detailed picture like i said it got like six inches away like i got like right up in its face and it didn't move oh wait you can't see my mouse can you see my mouse oh you can like see here you can see like the little like fluff around it and it wasn't moving and i got scared because see how it's like kind of green here the rest the rest of its bodies the rest of its body was like brown and i was like is it dead because <laughs> like okay i've never seen a frog this hurt or not this hurt this close so I was like, it's the, the, the coloring was weird. I was getting concerned. But it was alive. It, it hopped away, I guess, because it wasn't there when I moved around. But like, look at this. You can, like, the focus here, like, the blur in the foreground and the midground is in focus. Perfect picture. Okay, anyway, that's it. <laughs> Back to video games. Down to the next. What I get? I got first. Yeah, yeah. So guys, PSA: If you're out hiking or just out and about, don't touch the animals. One, you could get sick, and also two, you could give the animal bad germs too. So don't touch them. Don't touch their fecal matter or the feathers. Just don't do it. It's not worth. I know the feathers are cute and pretty, but just don't do it. Hi, Nix. Welcome to stream. Hope you're doing well today, hon. Potential third troll of the day. <laughs> no, I was talking about the frog decon. I'm not ignoring you, okay? When I have a thought, I have to finish it. Uh. Okay, which? Okay. Um, uh, what should I do? My Wario, cause fuck Wario. Oh, prediction. Okay, new predictions. Up, please, your best chat. I think it's also difficult to, like, read chat when I'm playing Mario Kart. Like, for Animal Crossing, I can afford to, like, li like look away from the screen for two seconds. But for Mario Kart, I can't really. That's why I feel bad. That's why I don't necessarily want, like... <laughs> I don't want, like, Mario Kart to be my main thing. Because, like, I feel like, especially now, like, I want to get to know my chatters and such. That's also why I'm glad that we're doing Animal Crossing every day. That way there is time to, like, have a more, like, just chatting section of the stream. Oh, you're actually practicing, Nyx? You're so cute. <laughs> okay, there always has to be, like, someone getting first, and then in return, there always has to be somebody getting last. Or, like, tenth. So you're fine, huh? You took off smart steering? I think playing with smart steering is D.O.M. Like, it's a lot more difficult to get, like, your lines and skips down. Dude, I fucking hate playing as Bowser. Can somebody please change my character? Please, for the love of God, change it. <laughs> Unless you guys want to see me struggle. Oh, dude, I, I thought it was going to fall out there. Half peach? Okay, thank you, Issa. I appreciate it. We'll change that next time. I love when I tell Jadders to do something and then they do it. I fucking love that shit. I'm not saying that I would love the idea of being a cult leader, but you know, it doesn't sound too bad. <laughs> if you're last, you're technically first in the other direction. Exactly. It's kind of like how in school, if you get a 30% and then you ride it into an 80, easy clap. <laughs> Has that ever, like, worked for anybody? Because, like, when I was in elementary, it was kind of, like, in the transition to where they would, like, start- where they would stop grading, like, 
papers and they would like fit all the grades online. So even if I failed the test, my mom would know. She could like look it up on my school's website. So I, I couldn't like hack the system anymore. First, easy clap. Wait, 80% in doubt? Really? Really, guys? Kinda cringe. Okay, I say that, but we're gonna be absolute dog shit when we start doing online. But hey! <laughs> okay. I was- I- <laughs> I was thinking of a transition for the ad break, and <laughs> I was gonna say, talking about dog shit, you know what else is shitty? But I can't be saying that. I- it was like, it's kind of like when you have a Twitter draft and you want to like post it, but you don't. That <laughs> anyway, we're about an hour into stream. You guys know what that means. An ad break is coming. So you can avoid that ad break by subscribing for just $4.99, just $5 a month. Or link, <laughs> or link your Twitch account to your Amazon Prime. You get a free Amazon Prime sub every month. My Prime went on to Rainy the Games this month. Or any secret Oilers, now is the time to give subs. Wait, I forgot to change my sub goal. Frick. Anyway. If we hit 50 subs, guys, we will get three new sub-only emotes. And it's not official, but if we hit 75 subs, I will do a cookie decorating stream. Honestly, because Cutie Cinderella inspired me to. <laughs> anyway, a commercial break is coming. Get a snack, get a water if you need it. We'll see some of you guys in a few. Gotta get the coin. Exactly. Exactly, man. Okay. Bye, guys. Okay, when I see a cookie decorating stream, I'm not gonna bake the cookies, because that is way too difficult. Out of, like, all of the baking... I think cookies have to be the hardest shit. Every time I've tried to make cookies... Okay, it's very hard to, like, combine butter into your dough. Because, like, you're not supposed to melt the butter. Typically. <laughs> and it is... Okay, we're doing the airport because I love the airport. I'm on mobile, so I'm struggling. Sag, I fucking hate Twitch mobile. I think we ran a poll last week. And, like, 40% of chatters preferred Twitch mobile over desktop. And, like, actually, what is fucking wrong with those people? How can anybody prefer mobile over desktop? I do not understand. The okay, subscribing on mobile is more, typically. You get a more delay. Unless you're on iOS, you can have low latency enabled for iOS. <laughs> what else is shit about mobile? <laughs> Okay, it's fine if you're watching on mobile, but honestly, start watching on desktop. Desktop is a lot better. Dude, I- I hate Bowser, literally. Oh, your laptop is- okay, downloading? Okay, got a buzz. That is a valid excuse. That is a valid reason. We'll let it slide this time. So, like, last night, I was in bed, and, like, I already turned my computer off. Like, I was in bed, but then, like, Prezo went live, so I was like, fuck, I gotta watch Prezo, because I fucking love Prezo. Um, and like I was watching the stream on mobile and like all of his emotes are like third party so like 7 TV or BTTV um, So like reading the chat room on mobile with like third party emotes is horrible I, n I don't understand how he used to do it before Cause like Prezzo's channel he has a lot of like obscure like <laughs> emotes enabled Like one was like eating a handful of cement I think <laughs> So, I was like, what the fuck is this emote? That's a big reason why, um, I have chat on screen now, with the 7 TV emotes enabled. That way, if you are on mobile, if you go to, like, full screen, you can still see the chat, like, the emotes on screen. But, yeah, Peach is illegal. How is it illegal? What? Nani? Oh, it's a redeem that, so during the next race, we'll do Cat Peach. Or not the next race, the next, like, I guess, round. Because I can't change my character halfway through a free.
Oh, also, chatters, chatters. I enabled a handful more 70v emotes. Okay, I feel like I say that every stream. But every time I watch, like, another stream, I'm like, Ooh, I need to add this emote. Like, which one did I add? I think I added... I added a few more people ones, I think. I added people paint. Oh, I added this one. This one's cute. It's D D This one is cute. It's DJ Kirby. First, easy clap. No doubters. Let's fucking go. I'm the absolute best at this game. <laughs> More emotes in the day. I can't use it. You just gotta be in here next time, Nyx. It's okay. It's fine. Okay, new predictions up. Go place your bets, chat. I was gonna say something else, but I forgot. Okay, I don't know why I went quiet there. <laughs> okay, awkward. <laughs> Okay, the final race. Any doubters? Let's see, any doubters? Come on, we need some doubters, guys. Somebody just put 10 points in doubt. Come on. 10 points. Easy. Won't be too big a loss. Oh, okay. I was gonna make a joke about gambling on Twitch, but honestly, I don't think that's an issue I can talk about right now. <laughs> um, my take is... Whatever. I don't give a shit. Okay, no, I, I actually care. Like, it's just, it comes down to, like, more responsibility of the individual. Like, it's not necessarily the platform's responsibility to moderate. That's my take! Love XQC, but also, he needs to, like, just stop gambling. No, literally, yeah. Because, uh, It's a whole debate that I'm like, do I really want to- Okay, I think one of my chat rules is no drama farming. And I'm literally drama farming right now by talking about it. Dude, I hate this section. I literally hate it. <laughs> Cause like, okay, the last thing I'll say about it. Um, I know the big way that like creators get money is through like sponsorships or partnerships, right? Like, I'm not necessarily open to the idea of taking a sponsorship. Like, I feel like it's cliche for like every streamer to have like uh, an energy drink sponsorship, which I don't think I'll ever take because energy drinks give me the shakes, so I don't want to promote something that gives me like anxiety. But I feel like there will come a point where I will have access to like have sponsorships or whatever, or like do an ad rule. And I think the biggest thing that I'm iffy about is the big reason why companies choose to sponsor creators is all of the little parasocial chatters will do anything that the streamer says or tells them to do, right? So if they say, hey, go buy this product, they will do it. That's why I feel like sponsorships are fine, but if you're sponsoring something that could lead to, like, long-term addiction, depression, trigger word, suicide, it's not... I don't feel like that's appropriate. Anyway, I hate gambling. <laughs> Yeah, Nissa, you, you're not old enough to gamble. So, no. Yeah, that's another issue too. A lot of XQC's viewers are younger. Like, i.e. like teenagers or young adults. And it's like, you don't want to be fucking up their lives when they're still that young. Yes, the gambling streams are entertaining. But should it be sponsored or promoted? I don't think so. Okay. I think that we'll do one more pre with computers. Yeah, I, I don't know. I don't want to be a cult leader. <laughs> no. I do not. Okay. So, Issa redeemed the cat peach. Oh, there is cat peach. I didn't realize. I hate it. <laughs> See, like, I've never even tried the lottery. Creates a cult for me. <laughs> This is gonna be the members, just you, Issa. <laughs> oh, let's see. I wanna do Shy Guy Falls, because I love this track. I'm not good at it, but I love it. <clears throat> yeah, Cat Peach is literally annoying. Wait, do I have- I think I have. No. 
thought I had. No, I thought I had a cat 17v. No, I thought I did. Fuck. I thought I had an emote called Meow. I guess I didn't enable it properly. <laughs> so <laughs> that's gonna be your, I guess, requirements for the cool. I think that's fine. I would love if we had a full lobby on Sunday. Thank you for the follow, Decon. I appreciate it. Did you unfollow and refollow? <laughs> Sag. What was I gonna say? Oh yeah, if we had a full lobby on Sunday, I'm gonna be so fucking hyped. Because as you guys know, whoever places top three on Sunday will get VIP for a month. Or until the next tournament. Which will be every month. Because I think right now I only have three people who have VIP. So you'll be pretty special if you win. Okay. I promise I'm good at this game, it's just Cat Peach that is making me throw. Yeah. Practice till you get blisters on your fingers, your thumbs, and break your controllers because you rage too much. That is the goal right now. <laughs> yeah, honestly, I feel like I, I like I can get like top three or maybe fourth place in the tourney. And that's if we only have four people playing. <laughs> Hi Fidos, welcome to stream. We're doing well today. If you have any preferred nicknames or pronouns, make sure to tell me. So welcome to stream. I yeah, I'm literally not a furry. Okay, chatters. Anybody new? I did not choose this character. Someone in chat redeemed it. I never will willingly choose to be a furry. Okay, okay. I just want to set the record straight. Sorry for being unhidden. But you're fine, you're fine. You're pretty tame today, so you didn't say anything too wild. No, okay. Also, I am not a TikToker, guys. Stop slandering me. This is literally... What is it called? See, you guys call me names, you call me a furry, you call me a TikToker, you guys made me lose all this name calling and slandering, defamation, not defamation, <laughs> name calling and jet. <laughs> Hi, Decon, welcome to stream. If you have any preferred nicknames or pronouns, make sure to tell me. <laughs> um, you have a very similar username to someone else in chat. We call Dee Dee, or maybe the same person, I don't know. But, make sure to tell me. Okay. I got third. End me, please. God, how'd I get third? That, that is genuinely so disappointing. I love being on Meg Talk. <laughs> I'm glad you guys like the TikTok, though. Like, I think out of everything. Okay, streaming does take a lot of time, mind you. It does take a lot of time. Oh, you just got a laptop? Is it a different account, honey? <laughs> <laughs> just, I got a lot. <laughs> okay, honey. <laughs> oh, it's just so, what? As long as you're not like follow body, I don't give a shit. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Yeah, literally Anna Montana. <laughs> okay, I do have an alt account, guys, but I never use it. I'm not gonna leak the name, but it's pretty self-explanatory. I said it before, but like, I would stream on the alt account, but also, I don't know what I would do. Cause like, I thought about doing art streams on there, but also, I definitely like doing like art and such offline. Cause like, when you're streaming, <laughs> there's like this underlying pressure to feel like you have to like, Divert more of your attention to stream than like what you're actually doing. Dee Montana. <laughs> we love the alt test streams. No, you guys. Okay, I literally only have two followers on my alt account. So, no shot, none of you guys are actually in the chat room. No way. Oh, what, what is Peach 
saying? Is she saying like, nya? Okay, I should not do that. Start. Don't. Let's not do that. We do not want chatters to clip sound bites. We do not need that right now. <laughs> clip? No, no, no. No, no, no. Don't do that. Don't do that shit. Don't. Please, for the love of God, do not do it. But actually, I don't give a shit. I don't say anything on stream that I wouldn't, like, keep to myself. You know what I mean? Dodge, easy. I mean, it's so funny because whenever I do do like a test stream on my alt to like just the test like tech stuff, I do like talk. Like I still have a chat room. Like it, it's fucking cringe. I say this every time, but if anybody's gonna start streaming, please make sure you test on an alt account before going live on your main. Because, like, for my first ever stream, I streamed for, like, two, three hours, and, like, there was drop frames, so the audio was, like, dropping and peaking. It was bad, and I felt bad because, like, my title was, like, my first ever stream, and it was dog shit! I felt so bad because, like, honestly, honestly, I had a lot of unique viewers that day. I had like 30, which is really good for a zero viewer stream for like your first stream. But I totally dropped the ball by not doing a test stream on an alt before. So chatters, please do test streams on a different account. Just do it. Shia LaBeouf, just do it. What did I get? I got first, right? <laughs> oh, there was no gambas anyway. Okay, fine, that's good. <laughs> yeah, literally, that's how I opened my alt teams. I'm like, today we're testing um, audio and like also frame rate. <laughs> okay, on to the next. <clears throat> okay, new prediction is up. Go place your bets, chat. Won't let you do channel play redeems on mobile? Really? That's wild. Try refresh your tab. Does it should still let you? I hate this turn. Worst turn of the game. Oh, I still made it though. Easy. <laughs> Dude, I am so fucking good at this game. Okay, I say that all the time. Like, I feel like I'm decent. I feel like I'm pretty good at Mario Kart. It's just when I play with other people who are better than me, I look bad. Like, any time I join, like, a streamer's lobby when they do, like, playing with viewers or, like, I'm playing with, like, regular online, I always get last and I feel bad. But the big thing is, if you get hit with one item, it's so difficult to catch up. And then you get hit with another one and then another one and then you're like, just GG's. Nothing I can do now. I mean, that's the big reason why. For this month's tourney, we're doing no items. That way we can actually see how good people are. <laughs> Because the way to stay ahead is just like min-maxing your lines and also like learning your skips and such. Dude, I'm in six. I okay. I did not realize I was this far behind. This is actually kind of pathetic. I think Neo Bowser City used to be my most difficult track, but I think this one always gets me. There we go, I nailed that turn. So chatters, if you want to win the tournament on Sunday, just choose this Rainbow Road every single time. Guaranteed win. I mean, not guaranteed that you will win, but guaranteed that I will just take a massive L every time. Wait, I'm in first? Oh my god. No! no. I drifted the wrong way, I drifted the wrong way. No, there's no way for me to catch up now. That's embarrassing. 
See, I like this bike build. I like the inside drift. But sometimes it doesn't work in my favor. Hi, Patch. Welcome to stream. Hope you're doing well today. Sag, doubters would have won big on that one. <clears throat> okay, let's see. I want to do Warriors Goldmine because I like this track. No prediction. Let's go ahead and get a new one up and running. I would be so happy if I had oven pizza right now. Who's the final one that we're gonna do online? Because <laughs> you know when you like go grocery shopping and you have a list and you try to stick to it, like you try your best not to buy like extra snacks or goodies. Because when you can't afford it and also like you don't need to be buying extra food because you have enough already at home. But like every time we go grocery shopping, we have to buy like a lasagna or a pizza. And I think that's my favorite part about grocery shopping. Just like the like not anxiety, but like the excitement of like waiting to have that pizza when you get home. I don't know. It's just like the little things in life, right? Hamburgers are made. What is wrong with you, Issa? Literally, I think that is the worst take I've heard from you. Hamburgers are fucking god tier. Are you like one of the fucking weirdo kids who at the school barbecue in fifth grade chose hot dog instead of hamburger? Are you one of those psychopaths? <laughs> okay, I don't know why I went off. I don't know why I went off right there. I, I feel like... Okay, food is definitely a topic that I'm like, I have very strong opinions on. You don't like hamburger- okay, you don't like hot dogs either, okay. That is redeemable. Do you just not like beef? Is that it? I think we had a discussion last week saying like, ground turkey. I think it was a unanimous, a unanimous vote in chat that ground turkey was better than ground beef. Where's Emmy beef? We need to like- we need to send that clip to her. <laughs> type of like meat or poultry the only thing i don't really like is like pork That's, okay we talked about last time how like my dad fucking messed up and made pork chops in the air fryer and they were dog shit he did it again yesterday and he also messed up because he was supposed to make like okay my mom oh he like actually fucked up because <laughs> like we prepped like this marinated pork loin dude it was so good but it was supposed to marinate for two days, not one day. So he made it like a day early and it was like made way too salty because like it didn't like fully marinate or like absorb the salt, right? So like way too salty and my mom was fucking pissed because <laughs> like it was a nice ass pork she got. But I feel like anytime my dad, like he's good when he cooks on his own. Like if he can make his own shit, he's good. But like if he's instructed to do something, he always messes up. Yeah, I agree. Chicken on the bone. Too difficult to eat. Very messy. Not worth. So I agree. Boneless wings are the way to go. Dude, I got fucking first and we had doubters this time. Let's fucking go. Yeah, exactly. Like, I feel like I'm wasting food if I don't, like, scrape the bone clean. We made them twice. I know. <laughs> My dad is actually throwing. <laughs> Okay, let's do it online. Let's let's take some L's, guys. <laughs> Anybody want to change my character real quick? I need to take a break anyway. Okay, next race. I just realized. 
Since online, we can change the character every race, so I don't need to wait. Baby Luigi, let's go! Someone did it! Thank you, Patch, for redeeming. <laughs> I was waiting! But thank you, I appreciate it, Patch. Ooh, sweet can you? Oh, I love this track. Yeah, I agree. Okay. Nyx, you saying you have to have the drumsticks? That's kind of cringe. You know, that's like a little 10-year-old baby palette where you're like, I need to have only drumsticks. I must eat it with a fork and knife. But also, it could be like sensory issues, so I can't be ragging you too hard. <laughs> Crickets. <laughs> um... Because my sister, similar to me, she, she has like sensory issues, so like she has- she like cannot stand anything like wet or sticky on her fingers. So she always eats like stuff with her- stuff with her like utensils, not with her hands. Yes, I do eat chips with chopsticks. I will not lie. Wait, the prediction is still for first, isn't it? Dude, I'm fucking stupid. I didn't change it. Dude, what if I get first? What if I get first this time? W only run, guys. I'm gonna get first. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. But yes, I have a bag of Cheetos right there off screen. I Yesterday, I ate them with chopsticks. I will not lie. You know, I am very honest with my chat room, and I will never lie. I will never scam. I'm still a believer. Oh, no, honey. Okay, I'm not gonna use my items. Actually, I'll use this one. <laughs> okay, I'll use items for this race. I feel like it's a little bit fair. Because I kind of want to actually try and get first. The guy's literally throwing. They went off track. Yeah, if you're gaming and eating, it makes sense. But like... Okay, what was I doing yesterday? I think I was like... I was working on a project. And, like, I was snacking. Because, like, I'm trying not to eat food when I watch, like, YouTube or, like, a show. Because, like, you know when you're watching something and you're, like, you snack on stuff and then you just keep eating? Like, I need to get over that. So I'm trying not to, like, watch videos as I, like, eat lunch or eat breakfast. Oh, that was way too close. You guys see that? The green show was, like, right on my ass. The content I said, I always wrote, quote, believe. <laughs> Where'd you get that contract from? It wasn't from me. Whoa! Way too much going on screen, Anna. Dude, I'm in 10th. I'm in 10th. Otherwise, it's weird champ. No, it's not weird champ. It's it's fucking cool. Okay, chatters, chatters. Tonight or today. When you're having your afternoon or evening snack, try eat your chips with chopsticks. And if you're unable to use chopsticks, fucking learn. Be an adult. Learn. It's not that hard. Yes, I've been using chopsticks since I was five years old, but also... Just learn. Like, don't be so opposed to, like, learning new things. Thank you for clipping, I appreciate it, Issa. No! Come on! Top three, baby! <laughs> Dude. I'm such a good gamer. <laughs> okay, let's fix our predictions. We're gonna do top six. Because I need to feel like I'm winning. Okay, new prediction is up. Go place your best chat. Gentle reminder, it is for sixth place. So top six or better. <laughs> Legal loophole. <laughs> Just buy. Okay. Do I need to demonstrate how I hold chopsticks? Do I have utensils? I don't have chopsticks in my room. Okay, I have a pencil and a pen. So, the way I hold chopsticks is incorrect, apparently. Because when I hold them... Focus. When I hold them, it rests on my ring finger. 
but it's supposed to rest on your middle finger. So I know I hold them incorrectly, but you know, I still use fucking chopsticks. Just not with rice. Dude, the rice is not that hard with chopsticks. The, the rice is sticky. It sticks to your chopsticks. You're probably just eating shitty ass r dry rice. Huh? <clears throat> we had a hundred percent believe? You guys are so cute. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna get first this time, guys. I'm gonna do it. Let me go harass my mom. We're off to a horrible start. Whoa, that <laughs> I'm like crazy right now. My lines are horrible. I feel like a lot of takeout is mid as frick. Like, I, I've been like, come on, come on. I've been like dying to go out to eat like at a sit down restaurant, which I haven't done in a long ass time. Cause like by the time you get takeout, it's like not hot. It's gonna be mid, it's gonna be messy. <gasps> Game changer right here. We gotta start Annabelle. Let's fucking go. Third place, easy, top three, top three. I'm disappointed. Wait, I'm still in top three? Okay. Okay. Okay, first and second are insanely ahead. Red Shell. And me. Literally the worst item in the game. No, I'm throwing. I'm throwing. Literally throwing. We're still in top six. We're doing, we're doing. We were doing fine. We were doing great. Not doing so hard right now. But I can hold. I can get up. How that guy fell off was ratio. <laughs> okay, I know like the ratio became a meme, but the phrase is so funny to me. Because before, like, I had the context, like, what ratio actually means. I didn't understand it. Like, I was just thinking, like, fractions, and I was like, this makes no sense. Okay. We still got tub six. We're still holding. We're still doing good. <coughs> Top six. Easy clap. I'm the best gamer that ever lived. Yeah, I agree. Like, Mario Kart is definitely a game you can't play all day for. Like, it's very easy to get, like, frustrated with the game. Cause, like, it's not necessarily, like, everyone's fault that they're, like, spamming items or whatever and, like, the RNG is just shit. But, it, it is very easy to get frustrated with it. Hey, new prediction is up. Go place your bets, chat! It is for top six, gentle reminder. Top six. <laughs> Yeah, I'm changing my sub goal because we lost seven subs over the weekend. Sag. There we go. New sub goal is up, guys. Goal is 40 today. See, like, I don't... How long is 12 races? Probably, like... A race is, like, two to three minutes, so probably, like, 30 minutes. I feel like I can play Mario Kart. Okay, offline. 
I could probably play for like an hour because I feel like I'm wasting my time. <laughs> Cause like I don't play games as much offline anymore. Like I stopped playing Unite. I know there's a new season, but I haven't played the game probably like a month now, unfortunately. So thank God I didn't buy any skins. Like that would have been DUM. But the only games I really play offline now is Animal Crossing. Cause like on the days where I don't like grind or like if I'm not streaming, then I have to like play offline to get like the logins and stuff. Cause like I'm trying to spend less time off stream like playing games and more time like making art. Like you guys know I spent 13 hours on this new wallpaper, exclamation wallpaper in chat for more info. Cause like I understand that gaming is like a really good outlet, it's healthy, like it keeps your mind engaged and stuff. But I, I don't want to be spending too much time. Because ever since I've stopped working, I feel like... I, I feel like I have more value in my time now. Come on! No! Please! I want to catch up! But... Blow show! Sorry, I, I, do, I do not know why I screamed. Okay, I was just yelling to warn everyone in front of me that a blue shell was approaching. Your lines are very bad after 10 races. I feel like my lines get better. Like, when I'm playing offline, I am actually pretty good. It's just on stream that I am horrible. 12th place, oh my god, last fucking place. Please, just... We got a 10th, baby! Okay, it's fine, it's fine. Like I said earlier, there's always gonna be someone getting first, and there's always gonna be someone getting last, so this episode is fine. I do not need to freak out. I was going for the skip. Okay, nice. We got 69 points in doubt. Good one, Jatters. <clears throat> I don't like any of these tracks. A new prediction is up. Go place your bets, chat. did not clean my glasses today. Surprised most everyone picked Excitebike when it's like the worst track in the whole game. This one's gonna be an L for sure. Sunday starts your villain arc? What do you mean, Nyx? What does that mean? Are you talking about the tournament or just like you as a person? Either way, it's concerning. <laughs> Stole my item box. I hate this game. I'm sending them for their villain. Oh, for the tourney? Okay. Okay. You know, I thought it would be a funny gag. If Megan does ever get a Discord at some point. <laughs> like, I jokingly say if we had 100 subs, I'll open a Discord, which makes sense to me. Theoretically, enough people will join, right? But I think a really funny gag for any future tournaments, once we have like a lot of people like consistently watch or join, 
I think a funny gag would be to get everyone in like a video call at the start of the tournament and like we all take an oath being like, I swear that I will not stream tonight, Megan. Like, hand on my heart. <laughs> and we'll abide by all the rules. I think that'd be a really funny opening gag. But I don't know, we don't have a Discord, so. Which, Megan's not gonna open one soon, so. Oh no, that was horrible. Oh no, how is someone behind me? I think that guy disconnected. Cause, oh, they're- they're moving now, okay. <laughs> I can afford that- no, I can't, Lavelle. I know, same. <laughs> yeah, cause like, I've explained it before. But- Dude, he fucking sniped me! I've explained it before. But like, talking to people is very, like, exhausting for me, so like, I know if I make a Discord, if it's not very active, then I'm not gonna be, like, as involved in it. And I know- I, I wanna, like, have a Discord that's, like, active and have people, like, in it and, like, enjoying their time in it, you know? Okay, is a- I- You saw me earlier! I was fucking crushing with computers, okay? Okay. And playing against you, like, little pleb chatters. You guys are basically just, like, computers. I can fucking crush all of you. <laughs> My, my lines aren't that bad. This one, this one was pretty good. This one was horrible. Look, I caught up to 8th place. That's pretty good. Oh, come on! 7th place! Fuck him over. No! Okay, actually, my lines for that last section was pretty good. I didn't fall off like I usually do. So... I did good. Sag, Doubter still won that one. Yes, it was a good fight. I, I, I did go up five places, which is pretty good. Because it is very difficult to catch up for last place. Let's go ahead and get a new prediction up, guys. I think we have time for maybe two or three more races. Predictions up, go Gamba. Stop stealing my points. <laughs> well, Issa would stop stealing your points if you um stopped believing, but you did sign that contract, so you're just a perpetual believer, which we appreciate. You know what's crazy to me? Hi, Scott. Welcome to stream. Hope you're doing well today. Um, it's weird to me how for like Twitch polls, people can like place extra votes. So the channel points are bits. That to me is crazy. I mean, is that not like an infraction on democracy? People paying to win the vote? actually crazy like I've been tempted okay I've been tempted to like enable bits or channel points for the votes but it just feels like icky it feels gross Cause, like I know a big thing for me like talking about substance donation just briefly I want people to feel like they're getting something out of it, right? That's a big reason why we do like writing games and a stream. That is why, like, like today we'll have extra stakes for donations. Oh, that guy got sniped. Dude, let's fucking go. Top three. Blue shell approaching. Blue shell approaching. Here we're not gonna boom it. Your phone's a no. Oh. No. This is the worst thing that can happen. Your phone's at one percent. Well. Salutes in chat for Nyx, because they're gonna die in a video game shortly. <laughs> no! I fell off! I tried to cut the corner and I committed a little bit too hard right there. Oh, no, I hate. 
I never go for the skip for that reason. I'm absolute dog shit at it. Wait, homie, why are you throwing a fire behind you? Literally so rude. That is psychopath behavior. Come on, hit him! Here we go. Okay, fifth. Let's fucking go. We got a boom box. Please don't hit me. What? Why is he targeting me? Okay, there was literally someone in front of me, and it's still the blue shell is still targeting me. That is, I guess, bad RNG. That was unfair. That was rigged. <clears throat> What did I get? I got fifth, so top six still. Let's go. Okay. Um, let's do one more race after this one. And then we'll do Animal Crossing. Yeah, I did decent on that one. But thank you, Nyx. Okay, new prediction is up. Go place your bets, chat. We got 63% believe this time. Okay, this is an easy course. If I don't get top six, I'm ending stream. I'll say it here. I'm ending stream. <laughs> <laughs> I to be I want you to make it interesting. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> Oh, that was pretty good. Do you have any shops open on Harvest Island? No, I don't. I don't know why I haven't unlocked it yet. I feel okay. We did get KK Slider last week, so maybe that was the trigger to unlock it. So we'll check on that today. But I haven't been able to like get the island yet. Or no, I, I can only access the photo studio, I think. So we'll check on that today. Okay, we got top five. Let's go. <laughs> no, just gifts. <gives> up. <laughs> Nyx is like, Megan, don't go. <laughs> but see, now I have to get... Now I have to get top six. I need to get my hours in, guys. I can't end right now. <laughs> Please. I was joking. I was... I, no, I was serious. I was serious. I need... I'm getting top six. Anyway, I need to save my budget for the SM3 World run anyway. Yeah, I think I game over to like four times last week. God, it was four times. Sag. Homie, stop throwing. Look, that's what happened. Okay, you see that guy? They threw fire behind him. They fell off. It's called karma. Frick that guy. Oh. Man, they got a star in third. I gotta start in fourth? Third? Oh. Fourth is still good, guys. We're not ending stream just yet. <laughs> okay, fourth is pretty fucking good, though. I think that's the best we've done in online so far. I almost put doubt. <laughs> I almost put doubt by accident. <laughs> Oopsie. Okay, last race of the day. Let's make it a good one. Um, let's do Chaka Mountain. Okay, last prediction of the day. Ooh, for Animal Crossing? Okay, we'll talk about this later. But maybe we can do- oh wait. We can't do Aurora Hunting because we don't have an empty plot. Frick. Dad, scratch that. Nix that. 
Okay, new prediction is up. Last prediction of the day. Can't keep up with the flowers? Well, that's your fault. <laughs> You're like, I don't think I've ever enabled the beautiful island ordinance. Because, like, I'm always like, I need more money because capitalism. Discouraging when you get with an item very early on in the race because as you see I had seventh and I fell to tenth. It's just like feels bad man Should I get Nintendo switch sports? Because like I've seen people play it and it looks like kind of fun But would you guys like watch me play that? Like for a one-off stream or something Because like I have, to, I have to justify buying the game because, like, my sister wanted to get it, but then we're also like, we're only gonna play it for one day and then get bored. And I was like, you're right. Because that's how most, like, any sports game goes, you know? Like, it's fun to got to buy for the gag. But, I don't, I don't know if it's worth. Come on, let me snipe somebody. What was the question? <laughs> um, should I buy the Nintendo Switch Sports for stream? And, like, do a one-off stream gag! You'd watch most things? Maybe. But then also, like, Megan doesn't- I don't have money to buy a new game, so it would be like in a month or two. <laughs> so I'm asking you now, and everyone's probably gonna forget that I even asked stream. <laughs> okay, sub goal, sub goal. If we hit 75 subs, I'll do Nintendo Sports. <laughs> because if, if we hit that, then I can afford to buy the game next month. I think that is reasonable. No! 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 Come on, I'm gonna get top six, top six. Only three more places. I can catch up. Copium, I can catch up. Hi, Minty. Welcome to stream. We're putting love today. Eighth? I got- how to get no items? What, cookie stream? Yeah, we, we can do a cookie stream and switch sports if we hit 75 subs. Eighth place, end me, please. Fuck, on our last race of the day. Oh no. Hear me out. <laughs> what, what, what's your proposition, is it? What, what you got brewing up for me? <laughs> okay, that was our last race of the day. Actually, actually, let's do one race for funsies. <gasps> okay, Issa, that was a great idea. We're fucking writing that down. We decorate the cookies first, and then we do switch sports. That is a great idea. Somebody fucking write that down. That'd be- that'd be fun. Cause we could do like- or we can like decorate cookies the day before, like wait for the icing to like set, and then do switch sports the next day. Okay, but also, if we play switch sports and I eat cookies, I feel like people are gonna call me fat. I, I feel like there's a joke there, people are gonna say it. So, chatters, don't say that. Be nice to me. <laughs> um, okay, we're doing one final phrase. Thank you for clipping- Oh, oh no. Thank you for clipping us. So I appreciate it. <laughs> you're, you're clipping it, so when we hit 75 subs, you'll be like, Megan, uh, pay up. Instead of writing it down. Okay, okay, got it, got it, Buzz. <laughs> okay, we're doing one more race before we do Animal Crossing. Ooh, shells only. What kind of cookies? I think, cause like I was thinking about buying like, cause at, at the grocery store they have like cookie decorating kits, but I already have enough icing and sprinkles. 
So I would probably just buy like a, a pack of like plain sugar cookies. All right, it's off screen. And then decorate those. I think that'd be fun. Um, I want to do DK jungle again. I need to redeem myself right now. Okay, let's get our last. Okay, I know I said it was last prediction, but literally our last prediction of the day. Will I get first? Okay, I'm gonna win this one for you guys. I'm gonna clutch. I'm gonna get a W. We're gonna get first. Uh, <laughs> I was gonna say, I'm gonna give away a million dollars, but we're not doing that. <laughs> Good imagine. Dude, what if I had Mr. Beast money? And... That'd be crazy. <laughs> I don't know where I was going with that show. Comedy. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna win. I'm gonna win. W only run? Oh, we need to do the um the run where I reset up I get first. We were supposed to do that this month, but I could probably do it. Uh maybe this is this is so fast. I was not ready for this. Because all the online lobbies are like 150. Fuck, frick. Dude, that's oh wait, it's only shells, isn't it? I forgot. We're doing only shells for this race. Green shell, baby! Oh, I should have held it for protection. Kids wear protection. Adults too, not just kids. Oh my god, this is literally way too fast. I was not ready for this. Hey, back in first, easy clap. What if we did a shell only tournament? We had to get a coin! I thought I was supposed to be shells only. It's kind of rude. Got scammed, clickbaited, jabated. Dude, that guy was in first. They have three red shells. They threw literally all of them. That guy's literally brain dead. Hi, hacker. Welcome back to stream. We're pretty well, hun. Your school is wild. Okay, if something happened, you don't have to share, but like. <laughs> I hope nothing happened. I remember there was one class in high school where, like, the teacher, like, okay, he said he cared, but, like, also they kind of didn't. So, like, it was a social studies class, so anytime he'd give a lecture, like, literally, everybody would be on their phone, like, doing other shit. Because, like, the way the class was structured, like, we were basically, like, learning out of the book, so instead of, like, listening to the lecture fully, we could have just like read the chapter and then like still passed the test. So I mean it's kinda nice with that format, but also like it's not encouraging people to really actually engage in like the classroom. So like I dead ass I brought like my laptop, because like the laptop I had back when I was in school that I purchased, like with my own money, mind you, was like it was one of those laptops with like a touch screen that you could draw on. So I would just like draw in the class all day long. Dude, I got first. Let's fucking go. Okay, Animal Crossing time. Any doubters? We didn't have any doubters. Let's fucking go. Oh, I, I was... <laughs> I keep on choosing the wrong option for predictions. But, you know, it's fine. Okay. So, we're gonna go ahead and switch gears to Animal Crossing. If you're new to stream how Animal Crossing works, it's usually a bit more chill. I'm not as hyper. <laughs> But it's more like just chatting vibes, so you can like ask me questions, talk to other chatters, talk to me. So I usually pay more, a lot more attention to Animal Crossing. I pay a lot more attention to chat when I play Animal Crossing. But talking about Animal Crossing and capitalism, you guys know what time it is. It is ad time. We are about another hour into stream, so that means I have to fulfill my contractual obligation and run a few minutes of ads. You can avoid that ad break by subscribing for just $4.99, just $5 a month. Skip your coffee if they didn't get ad previewing all month long. Or, if you, have an, um, <laughs> if you have a Twitch Prime, you can link it to your... No, if you have an Amazon Prime account, you can link it to your Twitch. You get a free Twitch Prime sub every month. Mine went out to Randy the Games. Or, any secret Oilers, now is the time to give subs. If we hit our sub goal, I will give chat a hug. Parasocially, of course. 
Yeah, exactly. Prime sub, it's free, it's easy. Only five heads. Sub with Prime. <laughs> anyway, we'll see some of you guys in a few. You won't be missing much. I'm be changing my cartridge, changing titles, so yeah. There you go. Okay. I think we talked about it before. But like, I like the- Okay, the idea of bringing like a pet in the school is cute, super cute and wholesome. But also- <gasps> Oh my god! We got a sub! Thank you! I appreciate that, Minty. I really do. Enjoy your ad reviewing and super cool sub bully emotes. I appreciate it, Minty. You're gonna go ahead? I know you're- You're not necessarily new to stream, but you aren't in chat often, but- at the end of stream, we do write chatters' names, all cutesy and stuff. In the sub only journal, I go I went ahead and linked the Twitter thread to it, but thank you. I appreciate it, Minty. Okay. So what was I doing? Changing the game. Okay. I know it's like cute to like bring animals to school, but also don't do that. You're a distraction. You might get suspended. You might get kicked out for the day. And also, you're not going to bring the litter box to school, so where's the little kitty cat going to piss and shit in your backpack? Bad. So don't bring pets to school. Like, also allergies. I don't know. Oh, yeah, exactly. Who brings the praying mantis? That is a little bit wild. That is a little bit crazy. Kind of cringe, but also praying mantises are kind of cool. But it was it in like a like a cage, not a cage, but like a receptacle, a little Tupperware. <laughs> they found it outside. <laughs> I mean, that's fine. I guess that's fine. <laughs> See, like I was definitely the kid to like mess around and play with bugs, but like I wouldn't bring it in the classroom. That was a little bit weird. Okay, what should we change our title to? Let's think. Oh, I can be like, I touched a frog today. Clickbait. Because <laughs> I told the frog story earlier. Let's see. I was gonna say, how about touching every villager? But that, that, that sounds very bad. We're not doing that. I'm not, I'm, I'm not doing it. I, I like the title, I lost her. I think it's so funny. Or she's never coming back. <laughs> <laughs> Referring to Aurora, my the love of my life. <laughs> Wait, I have something to show you guys. I, I gotta show you something when we log into the game. She's never coming back. <laughs> Sorry, this is genuinely so funny to me. Okay, titles now changed. Comedy. I don't know why I say comedy after everything. I just think it's funny. Yeah, I had a campsite villager the other day, and it was one of the little racing cat things. It was ugly, so I, did, I didn't invite them. Yeah, I saw a roly-poly today on my background. I didn't run it over, because, you know, I don't kill animals or bugs. That is cringe and psychopath behavior, and I am not a psychopath. <laughs> um, anyway, let's play the game. Okay. Hello there, everyone. Right now in Tibbaland, it is 1.04 p.m. on Tuesday, May 24th, 2022. Oh, by the way, if you want to rock or some new wallpaper to spruce up your place, Sahara is visiting. No, we're not gonna eat the roly-polies. <sighs> Honey. <laughs> No. <laughs> yeah, that is not psychopath behavior, that is just weird behavior. <laughs> okay. She sells lots of unique designs you won't find anywhere else. I can't wait to find out what she brought today. 
that's all for today. Have a fun day out there. Yeah, there's a few villagers that have, like, skins that look like racing outfits. And they're ugly. I don't- I don't discriminate, but also they're- um, I like cute villagers. So, can you visit my island? At this point, I don't add viewers as Nintendo friends. I might in the future, but not at this point. I'm sorry, Minty. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> the racing ones aren't tasteful or tasty. <laughs> I can vouch for that. <laughs> okay, okay. The thing I wanted to show you guys. So, I leaked last week on stream that I am... Um, I really like maid dresses. Like, a lot. And last week in the store... Okay. They had this maid dress. And I was like... I have to buy it. Because look at it. Isn't it... Isn't it cute? This is literally the, the perfect dress. And also... Also... Okay, I need to switch to... I took a video. I took a video. One sec. I need to make sure I don't leak anything. Okay, this was it. This was it. Okay. Okay. Wait, wait, it's bling! Why is it bling? Okay. So. Um, last week, Bubbles visited my house. And I used to hate the visiting my hand. Okay, it's all fun and games till somebody goes home. I hate saying goodbye, but I should head out. I should stay. Aw, so to be honest- oh, oh, What the fuck? She was talking way too fast. Okay, so I didn't realize that the villagers give you presents. <laughs> so, she gave me a maid dress. It's almost like Bubbles knows what I want. Because literally Bubbles has given me three cute ass dresses and she gave me a fucking maid dress. I, I think Bubbles watches the stream, guys. I think Bubbles is lurking. Anyway. <laughs> so. <laughs> the, the maid dress Megan is real now. It's canon. It, it's canon in the lore now. Okay, anyway, that's the side tangent I wanted to go on. I think Bubbles is trying to tell you something. Probably, or like Bubbles knows. Bubbles knows. Bubbles can read my mind or some shit. Okay. Oh, I need to... What should we do today? Uh, I wish on like the abandoned islands it would still have villagers show up. Cause I wish we could like kick people out. Okay, let's see how much turnips are. I think I bought them for 108 this week. Oh my god, we're selling them today! 132, I know is not the best, but you know, still pretty it's a pretty good chunk of change. So we're gonna go in and sell them. I usually will check like my turnip prices at the start of whenever I play, because I always forget. I don't think I've ever, like, had turnips expire. Because, like, I know there's, like, a slim chance of them being, like, 300 bills, but honestly, I'm not risking it. It is not worth. Okay. Um, I don't think I decorated much over the weekend, because, honestly, I was focusing on painting. So, I think also, like, I was looking through, like, all the decorations I can buy through, like, the miles and then the shopping. And there's nothing that I really liked. So I think for this week, just in general, I'm going to focus on um, like grinding materials. That way I can craft whatever I want to make. Okay, we're going to be filthy rich. So we bought them for 108, sold for 130. We are up about tw about 20 percent. I think that's pretty good. That's pretty good. <laughs> okay.
Okay, let's see. Oh, we can go to the deserted island first, because I forgot to do that last time. Oh wait, I need to, I need to bring an extra axe, I forgot. And I forgot to sell a turnip. Frick. Oh. I, I I zoned out for a second. Okay, let's grab a few axes. I've had people ask how I have so many miles right now. I have 110k. 111k, actually. But I think the best way to grind miles is to, like, make sure you upgrade to the Nook Miles Plus. And also, any time you get a redemption, just redeem it right away. Because whenever you do, like, a Nook Miles Extra, <laughs> a new one will, like, take its slot. So that's how I find that I was able to grind miles so easily. Hmm. You ready to take a tour? Round to Pharaoh cost you a thousand miles. Is my island a five star? No, I think it's probably still at a three star right now. Like, once I start actually decorating, it'll probably get back up to like a four, maybe. Because, like, the whole time I've been playing Animal Crossing, like, before I made the new island, I've never gotten a five star. I think it's because I never, like, truly committed to decorating. But my goal is to get a five star. At some point. Can we get some guitar times in chat, guys? random thing to interject. You know, I used to be slim and mean. I think the only crop I need is pumpkins, so I don't necessarily need to dig up the wheat. And I also got tulips, so I don't need tulips. He's a turtle, right? Yes, they've got a shell. Hi, Emmy. Welcome to stream. Hope you're doing well today, hun. This is very interesting how they have these, like, plots set up. Like, what? <laughs> Who designed this? I think they need to be... Not fired, but they need to have, like, a docking too. Because this... Th this looks a little bit wild. Uh, wait, I guess that's, like, modern, like, architecture. Because the thing to me with, like, good... I guess, like, garden design... Like, you have to have a very, like, clear direction on where you're supposed to go. <clears throat> I remember when I was little, like, I wanted to learn architecture. Like, that was one of the things, like, when I grew up, I want to be an architect. But genuinely, there's, like, way too much school and, like, learning you need to do to become an architect. But then, like, recently, like, I'm watching, like, all these home improvement videos, all these, like, gardens with, like, landscaping, these people making, like, these like, elaborate gardens, like, big-ass koi ponds and waterfalls, and I'm like, I want to do that. <laughs> but, a lot of skill, a lot of time, and it's like, not that I don't have time, but it's, it's a lot. That's how rich people decorate it. Yeah. True, true. So, like, wouldn't it be cool to be, like, the one person on the block in, like, your neighborhood? That has like a super nice like garden. Like I remember we were driving through Eastern Washington one day. And like the whole area was like rural, right? 
So it's like all these little houses, like people with these big properties. And it's usually just like fields, like all these like orchards and stuff. But there was this one house. And I guess the guy had like this huge like rock wall. Like this, basically like a waterfall part of his property, right? And they decorated it to make like this little pool and like a pod at the bottom of the waterfall. And it's like right on the road. So like the first thing you see as you drive past their property. You know, I feel like if you have a setup like that, you just instantly have bragging rights. And you just feel like so much better than everyone else in your neighborhood. <laughs> Like, you see, like, Shannon across the street, like, trimming the edge of the grass on the sidewalk. And then you just have, like, this nice-ass, like, pond and waterfall. It's such, like, a power move. Oh, big fish. Let's get her. Give me a rare. Give me a rare. No! I thought the, the small fish was targeting it, and then I... I I, I messed up. Shannon what? I, I tried to think of a normal name, okay? I don't know any Shannons. I feel like Shannon... Is Shannon like an old name? Because we have a lot of like older people where I live. So I'm trying to think of like all their names and I'm like, are they actually like old people names? See, I've said before that I don't want kids. Like kids seem kind of cringe. Cause like my POV is that like kids are fine for like a few hours, but I don't think I can ever like handle like taking care of a kid. But also, imagine me being old and not having any kids, and then I'm just alone. I think, I think that is the only justifiable reason to like have a kid in my mind. If you don't want to be like alone when you're like fucking 80 years old. But then when you're 80, your your kid is probably gonna be like 40, and they don't want to talk to you anyway. I don't know, just- just shower thoughts, you know? <laughs> Barbara, Patrice, yeah, those feel like more like boomer names. I- okay, I guess Shannon is more like- Uh, it's in between boomer and like millennial, I guess. A child in this economy? I know, exactly. Literally not worth it, too expensive. I was talking to my dad about it. And I was like, dad. If Megan ever becomes, like, a millionaire, I will make sure to pay you back for, like, all it costs to raise me. And he's like, really? You don't have to. But I was like, Dad, think about it. Well, I looked up an article that basically said that raising a kid in, like, a middle-income household will cost, like, 200k over the course of their life. Including, like, childcare, like, food, clothing, school, that type of thing. Not college, mind you. And, like, I was thinking about it. I was like... We were poor as shit when I was little. So no way they spent 200k on me. Like they spent- Let's do the math. I didn't do any sports. I didn't do any extracurriculars. We got clothes once a year and the, our budget for that was $50. So the probably most expensive thing raising us was like food. And even then, we got like food stamps and shit. So they spent maybe 100k <laughs> raising me and my sister. So I was like- I was like, Dad, if Megan ever becomes like a millionaire, I'll just drop 200k on you. Like, I don't care. And then we're even. Then you cannot say, I spent all my life and my money on you, child. And I'm like, no, I paid it back. Lamau, we are even. Argument settled. Exactly. That, that is what I picture Shannon to be. <laughs> okay. My mom. She's older now, right? And I feel like the, the most, like, old person thing to do is to join like a knitting club or like make a knitting club with her little like friends which my mom has started doing she's going to like she's doing crocheting like every other weekend with her friends and like it's cute oh wait she actually made me a blanket you guys want to see it i'll go to full camera real quick it's actually really cute i haven't used it yet though she made me a blanket 
It's kind of small. It, I think it's like five feet by four feet because she ran out of material. It looks a little bit like a carpet, but it's really soft. The yarn was on sale, so she's like, I have to buy it. But it's like this nice olive green, this off white, and the super light, like pink. It matches my comforter. Because my comforter is like this white floral print. I think she got that done in like 12 hours, because she's been working on that when she's like watching TV. You know, the old people shit, where they're just like knitting all day. Um. But yeah, she made that, that for me. Cause she's oh, I didn't switch back to game cam. <laughs> uh, she's making a blanket for everyone in the house. Right? So me, dad, my sister. And like, I think I chose the best colors because the colors my sister chose. She, okay, my sister fucking stupid, okay? She is not an art school like me. She does not understand color theory. She chose um, a mustard yellow, this really dark purpley velvet, and then the same green I did. And the purpley velvet she chose was like super dark. And as you saw, that light green was like this really soft pastel color. So obviously those colors will not go well together. Like purple and yellow already contrasting. Mixing the green, kind of cringe, kind of bad. <laughs> so, and I remember like I was there when my sister was like choosing out the colors. And I was like, sister. I almost said her name. I was like, sister. That's not gonna look good. And she's like, but I like all the colors separately. I'm like, true, but together, it will not look good. And she's like, well, I don't care. And I was like, okay, it's your blanket. I don't give a shit. And like, it doesn't even match her room. But, like, the main reason why I chose those, like, <laughs> well, would you? <laughs> Me? <laughs> I'm gonna text it to her right now. I'm gonna say, your blanket. <laughs> your blanket. <laughs> Your blanket color palette. That is so fucking good, Edgar. Your blanket color palette looks like Waluigi and Wario. It's autocorrecting. Waluigi and Wario. Lamau. <laughs> oh my god, she's at work, I know. <laughs> she tells me not to text her when she's at work. Okay, not like she's doing anything. <laughs> but... Because, like, at her workplace, she's allowed to, like, have her phone out and, like, listen to music. They just don't want people, like, fucking around on their phones all day. <laughs> I wonder what she's gonna say. She's gonna be like, you're stupid. <laughs> okay, I- did I really go through everything on this island? Oh, wait, I can still, like, harvest the wheat. I forgot. I don't need to, like, pick it up, but I can still harvest it. She's either gonna be like, you're stupid, Megan, or Lamau. That is my predictions for what she's gonna say. DLDR? Oh yeah, like, the color palette she chose literally doesn't match her room. Yeah, I think I got everything. Let's see. We can try fish a little bit here. <clears throat> Cause like, her, her comforter is like this really dark red. So the yellow, the, the green with the red, literally not gonna match. Another thing I wanted to get into was interior design. Like, I feel like that would be fun, too. Okay, I just like anything that has to do with design. For anybody who doesn't know, I'm in um, uh, college for graphic design online. So I know, like, basics of, like, just design stuff. Like, I'm no pro. But there's, like, little subtle, like, patterns and nuances you'll see in, like, everyday life that relate to design. Because design and art is everywhere. earlier i can't wait till june or i think it's during june or july that that shark starts spawning and i think those are my favorite because just the idea of having like a big ass shark get caught on your fishing line is entertaining to me
Okay, I realize that, like, when I, when I stream, I, like, lean in. Because, like, my chat room is here, right? It's, it's about here. And I feel like when I lean in, because, like, when I talk to my friends, like, in person, like, I lean in to talk to them. I'm, okay, I'm not a close talker. Like, I'm not cringe like that. But, like, I definitely, like, get close to people when I hang out. <laughs> See, I would love to go to a pride parade. Because, like, I've always wanted to. But, like, large crowds scare me. In the sense of, like, I know everyone there will be nice. But just the idea of, like, a large group of people scares me. Like, I sometimes hate going to the mall. Like, even pre-pandemic. Like, going to the mall during Christmas time? Oh my god, actual insanity. You're, like, shoving past people, trying not to trip on people's shoes. You lean in the direction you stare, that's so cute. I feel like I used to play like that too. Like, you'll sometimes see me do it on stream, but like, I don't like, go, like, I don't commit as hard. But I definitely do lean a little bit. <laughs> oh, there's more weed up here. Yeah, I feel like going to the mall is like the cliche thing that like every teenager does. Wait, you guys see that the little cricket hopped in the water? It died. <laughs> In a video game, in a video game. Okay, I think I'm still riding off that sugar high. That's why I'm like so like happy today. <laughs> yeah, I feel like the mall in my area is fine, but like the malls and like Fuck. there's this really nice one. Uh, I can't remember which one it is, uh, end me. I know which one it is. But, I think it's in Tacoma. Where they have, like, all the Asian stores. And I love it. No, it's not the Tacoma one. I don't know. <gasps> Big fish! It's gonna be a shark. I know it is. Nah, it's not a shark. Damn, damn. I feel like fishing next month is gonna suck because I think it's gonna be a shark and then it's never gonna be a shark. The debates are just gonna be so much meanier. Yeah, I agree. It is fun, like, exploring the mall and, like, walking through stores. But, like, you ever go to a store and then you feel bad for not buying anything? And especially, like, the younger people. Like, I feel like the staff are always watching me. Because, not that I'm gonna steal, because stealing is bad, but I feel like the the, the workers, like, always, like, watch you, watch you like a hawk. And it freaks me out. Because, like, I know when I go clothes shopping, like, IRL, it's, it's stressful because, like, it's hard for me to, like, look at something and, like, think it's gonna fit. Because as you guys know, I'm I'm plus size, so like it's hard to find stuff that fits me well. Like this one, I got this top about like my god, nearly two years ago at this point, and like it still fits really well. But like with my specific body type, because like I'm short and like wide, let's say, <laughs> um, like I have to try stuff on, because like it, a lot of like like the cuts with certain like tops and like pants and stuff aren't meant for my build because like i'm plus size but i'm also kind of stocky like my arms are pretty big like i i got you can't see it today but like i got some guns you know <clears throat> so like i feel bad whenever i go into a clothes store and i don't buy anything like after you try stuff on and like it just doesn't fit or like it doesn't fit right i'm like i i feel so awkward like putting it back on the rack and then you leave and you're like oh did everything go well? I'm like, yeah, but also nothing fit. Oh, dude, the worst thing when you go clothes shopping is like when they have something like a size smaller and then a size larger. And you're like, dude, I'm right in between. Please. Oh, we can't carry anything. Let's, let's let it go. Oh, I hate shoe shopping. I despise it. 
One, because I just hate shoes in general. And also, taking off my shoes in public, I hate it. Because, like, my shoe size, I have really flat feet, so, like, I'm a wide, usually. And not many stores have wide shoe options. And also, I... My feet, dude, I don't understand. They're either, like, a seven and a half or a nine. Because if they don't have a wide, then it's gonna be, like, a larger shoe size. But, like, my normal is, like, an eight and a half wide. And it's, it's, it's annoying. I... If Megan ever becomes a billionaire, I want a personal tailor and a personal stylist just to make me anything I want. That is the dream. When Megan becomes rich, she wants a personal sushi chef and then a personal tailor. You have a bridge on my foot? I don't know. <laughs> I don't- I don't- I don't fucking like know. I didn't take biology. <laughs> Maybe? I don't know. <laughs> We're not showing feet. We're not doing that today. Nice dry chatters. We're not doing it. <laughs> I'm joking. I'm joking. I think my feet are flat because when I was little, I used to wear like slippers or flip flops all the time. And like slippers, they force your feet to be flat. But like, you know, like tennis shoes kind of like arch your foot up. So, like, I always wear slippers. So my feet are just accustomed to that shape. But we can only go once a day. Frick. <laughs> only tier 3 subs. <laughs> That's why you guys want the Discord, huh? You want exclusive feet pics? No way. I've only leaked my feet on stream one time. And it was on accident. It was during, um... I had the phone cam on my desk, and I, like, moved it, and it showed my feet. I was like, fuck! <laughs> I think it was during the first calligraphy stream where I was, like, writing my followers' names. I think it was during that. So... I guess comb through that six-hour VOD! No, I, I don't care. I don't, I don't give a shit. Feet are, like, a natural thing if people... That's a whole, like, discussion I don't want to go into today. Because, like, I very much- I think people can do whatever the fuck they want. As long as everything is consensual. You know, I don't care. You know, I love Amaranth. She is my queen, okay? Oh, we already know this recipe, so let's sell some shit. Like, I'm very much like, if people want to, like, show their bodies, I don't care. It's cool. There's a market for it? Do it. Don't shame them for it. Concrete grippers? Please don't. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm not, I'm not gonna go that path. But I feel like if people want to do it, go for it. Not for everybody, but don't shame people who do. What are concrete grippers? Is that like the thing I picture when you say that? Is like you know in spy movies how they have like little the sucker things. Or where, like in cartoons where they have like little plungers that like attach to the wall and they climb up. Just me? Okay. <laughs> oh, feet. What the fuck is so? It's <laughs> a weird analogy. <laughs> they grip the concrete. Do your toes like dig into the ground when you walk? That is kind of weird, champ. Okay. Okay. Oh. I've noticed so much like Twitch vernacular is my normal like yeah suction cups yeah that's what I'm talking about hacker you're on the right track so much like Twitch vernacular is just normal for me like when I'm having like thoughts and I see something like off or weird I think to myself in my head weird champ and it's fucking cringe it's supposed to be a pun no no it's not a pun it okay a pun guys. English 101. A pun is like a play on the pronunciation for like the vernacular word. Like how a club can mean like a baseball club or like a bat or like a club where I'm meeting a people. That is a pun. Like it's a play on words. What you put is, is an analogy. An analogy is a comparison between two things. Or no. Fuck. There's an analogy and then... 
You mean feet grip things? <laughs> I don't know. I graduate. I got a two on my AP English exam, so I kind of know what I'm talking about. I think. <laughs> Basically, go back to the running board. Go back to the drawing board. Try again. <laughs> See, okay. I know all of my jokes don't land either. It's fine. It's fine. Yeah, I think the humorous one. Okay, I need to actually look it up. There's analogy, and then... Because analogy is when you compare two similar things. And then... Okay, I'm thinking of fallacy, but a fallacy is a statement... Like, perceived and presented as a fact. That is not a fallacy. My brain pun equals joke. Exactly. <laughs> Exactly. <laughs> See, okay, I'm like going too far into things. I'm, I'm like, I'm in debate mode, Andy Brain, right now. We broke. Yeah, you guys broke me. I am financially broke and also broken brain. <laughs> Dude, I think my least favorite thing about English class is whenever there was like a vocab test, you have to like make the flashcards. Hyperbole! No, hyperbole is an exaggeration. Hyperbole is like saying, Oh, Megan, you're the best marker player in the world! It's an exaggeration, because she's literally the not the best. That is hyperbole. Because there's a term for where, like... Simile! Yes, it is simile! I think... A simile- wait, fuck, is it? <laughs> um, the simile is where you say the thing is the thing, right? Oh, I already got that. Antonym. An antonym is where you say something is not like the other thing. Ooh. Oh, synonym- Wait, did I, did I mix it up earlier? So, a simile is where you use like and as, and then analogy is where you say the thing is a thing. No, it's something else, isn't it? Dude, I threw my all my notes from high school like a year after I graduated. I don't remember any of this shit. Are your friends called free grippers? Okay. <laughs> so that's just a you thing then. I, I thought to myself, was like, is that like a modern thing? A metaphor. Wait. Simile doesn't? Oh, okay, okay. Got it. Thank you, Nyx. We figured it out, guys. We're out of this stun lock. We can move on now. <laughs> oh my god. You're like half listening. You know, you're fine, hun. You you helped us solve this puzzle, this stun lock we were in. Just saying random stuff to confuse me. Isn't that like a normal stream, honestly? I mean, Animal Crossing is meant to like trip me up a little bit. It's supposed to make me like have shower thoughts. So you know, guys, throw shit at the board and see what works. You know. I missed. Got it. Easy. Okay, as you guys know, my dad is fairly handy. Like, he fixes equipment for hobby. Hi, Jammers. Welcome to stream. Hope you're doing well today. Anyway, oh, my dad is pretty handy. So, like, he likes fixing things for fun. He is one of the annoying neighbors. Who will dead ass be drilling and chopping wood at like 10 p.m., like keeping everyone awake? But you know, the neighbors love us. Joking, they hate us. Anyway, <laughs> so yesterday I was like working on homework and stuff, and I just hear him drilling. And he's like drilling inside the house, and I'm like, oh no, what happened? So I go up to the, the front door, and he has removed the doorknob from the front door. And I'm like, Dad, what the fuck are you doing? And he's like, it was crooked. And I was like, okay. 
So apparently, like, the internal mechanism was, like, fucked up, so... <laughs> he was like, Megan, I need to go to Home Depot and buy a new lock, watch the house, and I'm like... Okay? <laughs> I mean, not that... Okay, we live in a pretty good area, so, like, we're fine. But, like, just the idea of having, like, no knob on our front door for, like, two hours was kind of stressful. <laughs> and it was funny, we still have a screen door, so, like, we... Our door was still, like, locked, but still, like, the main house door had no lock on it. It was just empty. <laughs> I forgot to text my sister. <laughs> so when she got home, like, my dad hadn't come back from the store, so... I could hear her, like, mess with the door as she walked in the house. <laughs> so, like, I ran to the door, because I knew she would be freaked out. Because, like, an instant thought is if you come to your home and see the lock gone, you would think that you got robbed or some shit, right? Or, like... Some home we just needed a doorknob and they took yours. Like, I run to the front door and I'm like, Sister, Dad had to buy a new one because it broke. And she's like, Okay. She's like, I was gonna call you because I thought you like got murdered or something. And I was like, True, good call. <laughs> um, but it was funny. <clears throat> yeah, that's my story time. Because when, when my parents bought our house, it was, like, not fully, like, done. Because they bought it, like, 30 years ago, mind you. So, they bought it when it was... Like, it wasn't fully developed, so they had to do a lot of, like, TLC on it. So, essentially, like, my dad, he added, like, flooring. He added, like, windows and shit. They did a lot to this house. And I think that's like a big reason why I- I'm not opposed to the idea of moving out. But also there's so much like memories here, you know what I mean? the ground instead of talking to her. He made a mansion. No, our house is so fucking small. Side tangent. We have- it's a one and a half bathroom, mind you. But we only use one bathroom because the half bathroom is filled with the junk. So all four of us share one bathroom and it fucking sucks. It- uh And like, okay. I know it's cliche to take forever like when you're Taking a shower, I take max 30 minutes. But my parents, when they take a bath, they take, no joke, sometimes an hour and a half. And it's like, if I have to, like, piss my pants, shit out of luck. It's like, piss your pants, Megan. But it's like, how come they can take fucking forever? Like, I have, <laughs> I have a story where... <laughs> okay, embarrassing. Oh, no. Should I share? Should I share? Oh no, should I share? This was when Megan was like eight. Let's go to full cam. Let's go to full cam. <laughs> okay, story time. Nobody leak. Nobody, nobody tell anybody. Okay? So I was like eight. So this is an age where you should be like fully potty trained. Not, I know, I'm farming a little bit. I'm farming. Thank you for clipping. Oh no. Okay. I was eight. So, most kids are out of diapers by, like, five or six, maybe. Like, I am fully in control of myself. I don't piss my pants anymore. So, my parents were taking a bath. Me and my sister were, like, in the kitchen, like, you know. I don't know what we were doing. I think we were, like, putting away dishes together or something. And we were, she made me laugh. And, like, I couldn't stop laughing. And, you know, when you laugh so hard, you can't, like, control yourself. So I, this was like bedtime too, so I was in my pajamas, ready to go to bed, but we were putting away the dishes before bedtime. So I dead ass fucking piss my pants. Like, piss is everywhere. I, and also, also, it was in the bathroom and there was like a carpet, like a rug in the bathroom, or in the kitchen. 
I piss all over the carpet. All over the rug. And me and my sister, like, we're so laughing because it's funny, but also, I pissed myself. Also pissed on the fucking rug that mom made. So we're all, like, freaking out. Mom and dad are still in the bathroom. <laughs> and we're like, oh no! So... <laughs> and today's wild, isn't it? So me and my sister were, like, freaking out. She grabs me some clothes. I change really quick. We, like, grab the rug, grab my clothes. We, like... We just put it in the washing machine. We don't put it in the hamper. But we didn't start the washing machine. So the next day, <laughs> my mom is like, Hey, I saw something in the washing machine. She's like, what happened? And we were like, you know, you took too long in the bathroom, so... And Megan beat herself, and she was like, oh. You could have told me. I was like, well, mom... Either we don't tell you and you find out and you're still mad, or we tell you in the moment and you get fucking mad and we don't win. We literally don't win. So, that's uh, story time. I think that was the... Wait. Yeah, that's the one and only time I've pissed my pants. So, I'm on, I'm on a solid... Like, 15 year streak of not pissing my pants. Let's fucking go. Can anybody beat that? Actually, don't answer that. That's fucking weird. <laughs> oh, wait, did I buy it? I wasn't even paying attention. Whoopsie. Oh, well. Uh, let's see. Yeah. Yeah, did you guys enjoy that story time? <laughs> Longer than I've been alive, let's go! <laughs> uh, yeah, you're right, Agar, you're right. <laughs> it's still well to me. Oh, there's people born after 2000. Because I was born in 1999. So I'm still technically a 90s kid, but also not. It, it, it's weird to think that there's 20-year-olds who are born in like 2002. That is crazy to me. That is so hard for me to conceptualize. Because I just think like anyone born after 2000 is like a little baby. But there's like grown-ass adults. That's what a weird champ is, so what are you talking about? <laughs> it's only halfway done downloading. Okay, guys. Anybody who is living their life on shitty Wi-Fi, get a hard wire. Get a hard wire. I know it may be difficult, but set up a hard wire. <clears throat> Just like my setup right now for my hardwire is just like a long ass cable coming from our dining room to my bedroom. It's like literally the two furthest rooms from each other, and we made it work, you know? <laughs> Sorry, Issa, you're like, I love Weird Champ. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, let, let's get the chopping. Yeah, I think I enabled Weird Champ literally this morning. And the reason why I enabled Weird Champ was for the simp warning. Because <laughs> I'm surprised that I haven't enabled it sooner. Because Weird Champ is hilarious to me. Or like Paga. Because I've been watching a lot more of um, NAP LOL's streams, like in the morning. Oh! Because usually they'll do like cooking and then reacts in the morning. And like he just farms like Pogos all day and it's funny. And then I looked at my emotes, I was like, dude, I don't have Weird Champ enabled. I need to do that. 
Yeah, or you can do the what face. Yeah, I have that too. <laughs> I feel like I need to go back and like edit my emotes. Like, I kind of want to make them more saturated because see how like the PSI 2 what face is kind of dull? Like, it's not as bright. I feel like I need to color correct it a little bit. But the issue with me is since I'm technically still like a newer affiliate, because I gained affiliate in January. So in order to get like instant approval for emotes, I think you have to stream for 60 days. Like once you become affiliate, then you get like instant upload. That way my emotes get instantly approved. So I kind of want to wait for that before I change and like update my emotes. Because like it can take up to like a week or two to get emotes approved. So like imagine I like change all my emotes just to get the colors brighter and then you guys don't have emotes for two weeks. When did you guys like lose your shit? So I will update the colors and like increase the saturation for some of them once I get that eligibility approved, Sag. I think the big reason why is because like I don't necessarily stream as much because I only stream three days a week. So. That is an interesting question, isn't it, Issa? No! Fuck! Oh, I didn't- I didn't turn around. I threw. I literally threw. Actually, I clutched right there. Look at that. One for zero, baby! Yeah, I'm a fucking pro at catching the bees. Well, I was genuinely so sad because the other day I played offline, right? And I got like six wasps. And I didn't catch any of them. I was genuinely so sad. I feel like talking about like, um, like humanoid or like animals and like children's media. I feel like it was initially presented as like, because like kids like animals, right? I feel like it was meant to be like wholesome, but then like just. Also, like, if you look at a lot of, like, children's media, especially from, like, the early 2000s, there's a lot of, like, adult jokes written, written into it. Like, whether it be, like, how a character moves or, like, the dialogue they say. Like, if you watch Shrek again, there's a lot of, like, subtle, like, mature jokes in it that go over your head. And I was watching it back, like, two years ago, and I was like, oh my god. I can see why this could be rated, like, maybe PG-13 now. But I think it's because it's adults making the media, so inherently there's gonna be like subtle nuances. <clears throat> that kids won't necessarily understand right away. But the more they're exposed to like certain jokes or media, I can see how it can influence them. Not saying that kids should be making TV shows, that'd, that'd be fucking bad content. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I remember back when like YouTube was like popping off My sister she wanted to make a YouTube channel where she would like play with her Barbies Not like how on like TikTok you'll see like clips of like people like role-playing and like soap operas with their dolls Like she wanted to make that type of content And I remember we were filming on like our Samsung S1s so dog shit quality and they were so bad. <laughs> so like, if a kid can make a TV show, that's probably what it'd be. It'd probably just feed them like filming videos at home. On their smartphones. And it's just like, bad content. Oh, can we do it again? Can we do it again? Oh, two for zero, baby! I'm on a roll, guys. Oh. You can let it go. But dude, that's a pretty solid run right there. Okay, let's go drop up some stuff and then come back here. <clears throat> dude, if I get a 100% B run today, I'm gonna be so fucking happy. I don't think I've ever not gotten stung in one day. No, like, it's like, I'll always get stung at least once, but if I can get, like, 100%, no stung run today. That'd be amazing. Oh, I forgot to plant the flowers. That's it.
Oh, I also forgot to drop off things at home. Why does B emoji pop up whenever I type wasp? I don't know. I don't think it's a 7 TV emote. I don't think. Wait, wait, wait. I just found this. <laughs> wait. <laughs> Look at this emote. It, it's sag but gold. Is your reminder that shark gummies exist? Thank you. I haven't thought about that in a long time. But thank you, Issa. Oh my god, the other day... Because there's a corner store nearby, and like, I haven't gone to that place in a long time. Because the corner store that I have... Everything is very overpriced, and a lot of the stuff they have... Is probably like re not recalled items or like rejected items because like half the stuff doesn't have like price labels or like the proper like packaging on it or sometimes it doesn't have like an expiration date so it's probably stuff that got like rejected at like a main store and just sent to them which is fine you know was food not being put to waste but I spent $30 on snacks and it was literally only like 10 things in like, because the whole appeal to like quarter stores, it's easy, it's quick, it's right there, right? But after I left the store and after I checked out, I was like, dude, I could have gone to fucking Walmart and bought like 10 times as many snacks. Why am I doing this? I'm literally never coming here again. But the quarter store, they had key lime flavored Kit Kats and I literally can't find them anywhere else. It's one of those like limited time promotional favors and it's amazing. Because it has like lime flavored cream. Like, on the outside, and also, like, graham cracker pieces in it. It's so fucking good. Hmm. Yeah, so, I spent $30 on snacks when I didn't need to. Feels bad, man. Thank you, no for the follow. I appreciate it. Feel free, Lurk. Chat whenever makes you happy. Um. What was I gonna say about- Oh, yeah. And, like, whenever I would, like- Go to the snack store and see what's there, right? I would always- I always used to get, like, gummy candies. But as I've gotten older, I, like, walk past the candy section now. <laughs> it's not that I don't like sweets. I love sweets. Like, it's my all-time favorite. But I can't sit there- I can't justify eating a whole pack of gummies in one sitting. Like, I feel like that's a bit much. That makes me feel like a child. And, like, I know I should not be eating that much sugar. <laughs> Hi, Noah. Welcome to the stream. Hope you're doing well. Yeah, the Japanese Kit Kats, I've said it before. If you have a chance to buy them, I know they are expensive, but definitely try them. They are amazing. The chocolate tastes so much better. And, like, the flavor variety. They have seasonal flavors. It is crazy. And what's cool is that with Japanese Kit Kats, they have, like, a regional strawberry flavor. Because every different, like, region or territory, let's say, has, like, a different variation of strawberries. And they all taste slightly different. It's so good. <laughs> oh! Oh, no! Oh, no! Quick! What? No! Dude, run ruined. Run absolutely ruined. We are at a Megan 2 Bees 1 now. Damn. Ooh. Hey, you guys hear that bell, don't you? You know what it's ringing for? Anybody know what it's ringing for? It's ad time, baby. Just on time. We are another hour into stream, so that means I have to run an ad break. So you can avoid that ad break by subscribing. For just $4.99, just $5 a month, skip your coffee today and get ad reviewing all month long. Or, if you have an Amazon Prime, you can link it to your Twitch account and get a free Prime sub every month. I know my Prime sub went out to Rainy Day Games this month. Or, 
if we have any secret Oilers, now is the time to give some subs. Anyway, we will see some of you guys in a few. Okay. Uh oh, Tupia. What? Uh, what do you mean? Uh oh. Did you miss something? Rut row. <laughs> Welcome to stream. Hope being well today. I'm doing pretty good. I'm doing good today. I've had a lot of sugar, so I've been a little, little bit more hyper than usual. But I'm doing great today. Enjoyed my weekend. I hope you're doing well, hun. Wait, it's your birthday coming up, right, Hupper? I think you said yours is like June first, yeah? Wait till you're back, hun. <laughs> Tell me when you're back. You can't hear me. Fuck! <laughs> I'll type it chat. I'll type it chat. Tell me when you're back. <laughs> I'm so mad. <laughs> I forgot. I forgot we just ran an ad. Fuck. I totally blanked on that. Anyway. <laughs> I think it is kind of nice how, like, Twitch will still play the video when they run an ad. But. It still sucks. Like, okay, I've, I've explained it before, like, I wish I could not run ads, but it's it's essential for the platform. Like, honestly, Twitch is losing money with just the whole concept of, like, a Prime sub, so, like, if I have to run more ads, but also we get to keep the Primers, I will be happy. I'm fine with that. That is a good compromise in my eyes. Just got a Doctor Strange good movie. What would you rate it? What out of 10? What out of 10? But hi, Kitty Lee. Welcome to stream. We're doing well today. I've heard mixed reviews. I'm not gonna see it. The best movie? Okay. I, I've i heard different takes than that. Because, <laughs> like, I don't necessarily like superhero movies. I think they're all kind of cringe. But... I'm glad you liked it though, hun. You're back? Okay, fur fur. 10 out of 10! Whoa! Whoa, that is a crazy, Katie. That is a hot take. Oh, can we do it again? Okay, we're not gonna turn around. Grab our net. Swipe! Dude, I fucking got it. Okay. I think the strategy... I have changed my strategy now. The strategy. Quickly dash away. Do not turn around. Retrieve net, wait, and time it to swipe and catch them. I think that is the new strategy. So if you are able to like run away, run. But if you can't, you just have to follow the um, you have to follow the step back, turn around, retrieve net strat. Oh, you collect comments. Okay, that makes sense. Oh, um, for I was saying during the ad break. That your birthday is coming up, right? I think you said it's June 1st, yeah? <laughs> you thought it was mid? Yeah, that's most of the takes I heard. Like, I'm not gonna watch it, so, like, I'm not gonna have a take. Oh, you know what I'm excited for? I'm excited for the Buzz Lightyear movie. Because, like, any animated Pixar movie I'm gonna watch. It's June 1st? Yeah, it is June 1st. Pod go. Are you gonna do anything for your birthday, man? Because, like, I know I'm streaming on June 1st. So. Oh, chatters, chatters. I was gonna say. Like, we usually do, like, calligraphy at end of stream. But if it's like your birthday or something, like, I'll write your name for free. I think that's fair. Because the thing that I will do in, um... I'm in a few Discord servers. I'm not gonna say which ones. But a thing I will do for, like, people's birthday... Because in one of the servers that I'm in, they have a specific channel where, like, people can, like... Add their birthday to, like, an alert box. That way people get pinged for people's birthdays. So, like, a thing I will do... Is like I will write their username like all cute and stuff in calligraphy for their birthday and like post it in that thread. Wanna write my name? It's not your birthday, Katie. You know, 
how to get me to write your name, Katie, you can subscribe or gift subs, maybe. Maybe. Mod check spoilers. <laughs> or there is a channel for redemption as well, chatters. If you're broke like me. Oh, can we do it again? We're gonna dash. Oh, fuck, he got up! Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 no. Dude, I still caught it. I still caught it, baby! That is um, three for Megan, one for me. Let's fucking go. Are we just gonna chill with my family? Yeah, that's usually what I do too. Cause I remember when I was little, like we'd have a birthday party every year, but now that I'm older, I'm just like, I wanna either stay home and maybe go out to eat. We still, okay, I know my birthday was last month, literally, literally exactly a month ago, cause it's April 24th. Um, Like we still haven't gone out for dinner yet, Sag. Oh, so maybe maybe in June we will finally go out for dim sum like I was promised. <laughs> okay, granted, the money that was supposed to be for dinner, um, my mom spent on buying the yarn. So I guess it's fair. I, I got a I got a quilt for my birthday, not dim sum. I think that's fine. <laughs> well, from never catching whilst being expert. Yeah, I, I have good strats. I've I've developed a good strategy. I'm a pro. I'm a pro Animal Crossing player. Okay. I think we're gonna um, chop this tree down and then do you laugh at this. Should I take you out to dinner? Um, maybe. Um, maybe. <laughs> oh, but honey, I know you're broke too, so... <laughs> we need to get like someone nice to pay for our dinner. <laughs> Anybody who doesn't know, I know Katie IRL. She's my friend. She's not weird champing. She's not a simp. I know her. Let me clarify. Okay, so I'm not going. To chop my fruit trees because like I said I want to try and decorate this week and next week so I'm not gonna chop my fruit trees until I rearrange everything so I don't want to chop the trees I want to see which like fruits I have so I'm not gonna chop them yeah today was a wild stream wasn't it so <laughs> but glad you guys are here today was a crazy day yeah dude okay I haven't had Olive Garden in a long time but I, I only have good memories of it I've never had a bad time at Olive Garden I want to go to Olive Garden real bad. Um, let's see. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and save right here. Wait, actually, I need to redeem that Nook Mail. I just saw it. So I'm gonna go ahead and save, and I'm gonna switch gears to You Laugh, You Lose. If you are new to stream, it's basically React Andy. If I laugh, I end stream. Easy clap. Okay, let's save now. I think the last thing I had from Olive Garden was like this five cheese lasagna. It was pretty fucking good. And like, okay. I haven't gone out to eat in a long time. You know? And I like the idea of going out to eat. Cause like, I'm very much a fan of like environment. Like the atmosphere of the restaurant. But also, it's hard to justify playing $20 for like a plate of ravioli that has like five raviolis on it. You know what I mean? It's not worth it. Way too expensive. Anytime you go out to eat, even like fast food now, it's kind of like higher price point and it sucks. Okay. So, let's go ahead and set up you laugh, you fucking lose. I mean, freaking... Oopsie. <laughs> hey. Did we drop? Okay, I think we're fine. We're fine. Oh, I was looking at something else. Okay, I was freaking out. I was like, totally freaking out. Because, like, it says my upload right now is at 6k. Like, and I thought the 6k was how many frames I dropped. And I was like, oh my fucking god! But, you know, we're fine. We're fine. No, no need to lose my mind. Okay. So, let's change our title. Give me one second, guys. I, I love changing the title for this section because <laughs> I love titles that are in all caps. 
I think it's it's so funny. Like it's such like a it's like what the big guys do, you know, like XQC Hassan, where they just like type in all caps and it's funny. Okay, if I laugh, I dude, I'm talking so loud right now. If I laugh, I Okay. So if you are new to stream, how this works is if I laugh, I end stream. If chat laughs, type one in chat and tell me what made you laugh. Oops. Okay, you guys ready? Oh, it's on springs. What is she doing? Yeah. Yeah, it's a little bit creepy. Please, like, flip when the bee drops! Oh. I wanted the guy to, like, you know, like this. Okay, homie was trying to eat it with a fork and knife. I think adding cartoon sounds is like the stupidest meme. It's my least favorite trend. He deserved, honestly. Wait, 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 wait. I'm a joke, I'm a joke. my sister when she tells mom I hit her but I actually didn't. Can we get some drinks? I thought that was fucking funny. What the? Oh my god. Oh, it's copying the beeps. Think of the house, Kitty. It's a reverb! Oh! Oh! That's the worst. Wait, wait, wait. We need to go back. We need to go back. Oh, okay. I thought she was like, what? It looked like that was obviously like a porch or a deck, but I thought she was like walking it to put in a car. Kate, you're like, I only punched him a little bit. It's only a black guy. I didn't, like, knock him out. Katie, right now. <laughs> Can we make the new trend adding Mario sounds? Not cartoon sounds? I would love that trend. Don't let go of it, Dad. Oh. Yep, got it. Staged. Oh, no. That was good. This one power 
powerful product. Removes tough stains and disinfects all over your bathroom without hard. Can you just back up, bro? trying to eat oh Oh my god. Yeah, that was a great edit. Hey, if you see... People are stupid. <laughs> there's a guy in the background. See, there's a bike and there's a guy in the background. Oh, it's just wholesome, okay. Who said it don't be cold in Virginia? Who said it don't be cold in Virginia? Oh, oh what the fuck? Traffic, and I'm gonna look really stupid when I do this. Alright. I'm doing a cartwheel. Fuck you, loser! Thanks! 12 inches of delicious! What? What is that? Is that a fucking Komodo dragon? What the fuck? In the sewer? What? What? Genuinely, what was that? Homie keeps filming. Doesn't even help. Keeps filming. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, so I got just a few things. Oh. Oh no. Yeah, that was good. That was pretty good. Anybody get got? I got I got pretty close. I got what what almost got me? What was it? Dude, it was a I feel like anything Mario related will like get me every time. Oh yeah. Okay. Um I was gonna I was gonna try something. Oops, I was gonna try something today. So do you guys wanna do another video? Want to do another video? Because I have time today. Another vid? Well, I'm a, I'm stuck on all caps, sorry. Begin. Or nah. Okay, we're going to do a short poll. A short poll. Only for a minute. Only for a minute. Do you want to do another video? When she drops the glass thing. Oh, I did the wrong one. Go vote. Do you want to do another react? Another you laughy lose? Again! Because <laughs> in this playlist, there's literally like a hundred videos. So we got time. We got a lot of vids. Stall the poll? No, what do you mean? What do you mean stall? Right now we have 100% for again. Nobody wants to move on, Sag. Nobody wants me to end stream. <laughs> Oh wait, the whole premise is if I laugh, I end stream. So, um, I don't know.
You know what's another thing that I saw? Okay, you can't. Okay, we'll do one more bit before. Before. Uh, let's see. This was revealed on the last episode of Last Week Tonight by John Oliver. There is apparently a Subway K drama. Oh, wait, I saved it. Wait, fuck. I gotta find it. I marked it. Are you back? I'm looking. Connecting. Sorry, sorry. Is it back? Okay, it's back. If you see an app screen or if it's still lagging, refresh your tab. Okay, I think it's because I opened a new window. Lamau. Okay, anyway. There is... I'll, I'll, I'll show it to you guys tomorrow. But there is, like, an official K-drama that was, like released and made by like subway and it john over so showed some clips and it's fucking funny no yeah it's like a parody drama where like all the scenes take place at a subway and it looks fucking cringe and funny so maybe we can react to that tomorrow so i'll, I'll get that because it wasn't it's in like an archive playlist so i gotta find the playlist but yeah, okay, let, let's do another You Laugh, You Lose before it apps again. Oopsie. It's because it's literally, I draw, draw frames because, um, what you call it? I opened a new window by accident and that just made everything shit. Okay, new React. Okay, I'm going to show you guys what I have. Wait, wait, wait. You know, you know what homie just did? Homie just, um, homie just, um, Punch the guy. Ah. <laughs> oh. Hey, bro, you want to roll back the sunroof? Of course. Sick. Such a good clip. So good. <gasps> oh my god. Five head. Oh, you guys hear that thud? What's up, Connor? Yep. Oh my god, catch him. The thud? That was pretty fucking good, wasn't it? Okay, well, you have yourself a blessed day. Okay, you too. You must. That's good. Yeah, me pica esta piedra. Ay, me estoy quemando, me estoy quemando. Tranquilo, yo te pongo agua. Toma, toma, toma agua, toma, toma. <laughs> What is that? I thought it was always weird how you had to boil like mason jars to make preserves. That was always weird to me. Was I make chili oil? Oh, that's what it was. Okay, that makes sense then. Go do something, man. Has this whole room tonight because there's no other kitties in here. <laughs> oh, it's gonna, it's gonna like suck it in. No, 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 it's coming. It's, no, 
Oh! No. I hate that shit. Oh, no. You just throw the car away. Sorry, just like the lady in the background with the moped on the wall. She was like, Robert! Oh, was that like a head prop? That's actually a pretty good prank. <laughs> Wait. Question? Turkeys have hair? Did you guys get shot at? Water? No. Here's how to make my favorite snack. You start with some string cheese. Okay. I just took it out and it looks good. I just super daddy my pants. What? Should do wrong. I shit my pants, I think. Right. 27,000 followers later. Oh, man. Move it. <laughs> oh, no. Dude, I hated that. Why though? Oh, no. Dude, this is just obnoxious. Who did the water to? You mark Sega. Oh, uh, he could have saved himself. <laughs> oh. Yeah, that was just sick. Oh my god. That guy is not a good friend. Bad friend. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, I, I didn't get got. I didn't get got, but that was, that was pretty good. That was, that was good. Okay, we're not gonna do another one. I think two is good for a day. I think two is good. We can't, we can't be doing too much. Oops, oops, why oopsie. Uh oh, that's kind of cringe. Oh, I did the wrong thing. Okay, let's put some music on. Oh, it's wild. Okay. Is the music good or is it too loud? I'm gonna lower it down like a little bit. Oh, what is that? Oh, oh, wait. I feel like this is good. Okay. 
Okay. Okay, so if you're new to stream, what we're gonna do right now is... For anybody who subscribes, cheers, gifts, or donates throughout the stream to get the name ran and stream in my sub-only bullet journal, I linked a thread to all the previous names that were written. I'm gonna go ahead and get my second camera set up. It's connecting, give it a second. Dude, my laptop is so warm right now. Okay. Let's go ahead and get my journal. I almost yanked my headphones out. It is connecting, it's connecting. Oh my god, first try connected, let's fucking go! Okay, I gotta change my title. Dude, that's fucking sick. Okay, so if you sub gift. There you go. So if you subscribe, gift, or use your channel for redemptions, I will write your name right now. What we're doing right now is we're writing subscribers or gifters name. There's a link to a Twitter thread of all the previous names in chat. Also, just a gentle reminder, we are doing a Mario Kart tournament next Sunday, the 29th at 11 a.m. So be there, and if you place top three, you get VIP. Okay. okay. So, Scootish. What is Scootish as usual? It's like this purpley. Oh yeah, this nice like indigo purple. And green. Dude, that S is so pretty. Look at that. It's like a swirl almost. Okay. I think it's cool. I messed up. Fuck! You can't tell, but I'm actually. Oh no, oh no. I'll just wide it up. I'll wide it up. You can't tell, it's so small, but I accidentally did a stroke for you instead of an S. It's fine, it's fine. I'm fine. I'm not freaking out. Okay.
go. And then, also had Thin T subscribe for the first time at tier one. I think New Year's name was like Ice Magenta Hot Tea. Okay. <clears throat> <laughs> I mean, crying on stream is content, isn't it? Like, crying is fine sometimes, am I right? I think it's fine. It's alright. Let's go. Go ahead and add some accent lines. <clears throat> there we go. So... I think that's all I have for you guys today. Um, I don't know if anybody's live right now. We can see. Let's see. Badge, no one's live. Um, yeah. So I'm gonna go ahead and call it a day here. Thank you to anybody who came to the stream. Any chatters, any lurkers. I appreciate everyone. Um, Oh yeah, gentle reminder, tournament is on Sunday, so be there. Make sure you guys are practicing throughout the week. And I will be live again tomorrow, same time, 11 PST. We are doing um, Kirby and the Forgotten Land, so make sure if you aren't already, have go live notifications on. That, you, that way you'll be pinged when I go live. Or if you aren't already, go follow my offline social media accounts. I have a Twitter, Instagram, and a TikTok. If you aren't already, go follow the Instagram. I <laughs> I did not meet the command right. Go follow my Instagram. I don't post as often, but, you know, I post sometimes. <laughs> anyway, anyway. I'll see you guys tomorrow, and as always, it's a pleasure hanging out with you guys. I, mean, I appreciate any chatters, lurkers, gifters. I appreciate everyone. I'll see you guys tomorrow, and I hope everyone has a good day. Okay. Bye.